All right. First stream of the new era, of the AJ Omega era proper. And I can think of no better way to start it by playing one of my favorite games of all time. This, folks, is Driver San Francisco. Now, you'll see that name Driver and you'll think, hmm, Driver games. There's been a lot of them. Yeah, there has. Back on the PS1, there was the original Driver, which is a straight up kind of pastiche of 70s cop shows. We've had another tip. It's Skeletor with £1.37. A Brazilian tenor is nothing for you, but here's a bit to get that grand, grande Turismo 7. Big, big love. Thank you very much. We're now £6.37 down. Uh, uh, £593.73 to go, if my maths is correct. But there we go. Thank you, Skelly. Appreciate that a lot. You should all go check out his Twitch as well. He's awesome. Grande Turismo Sete. <laughs> so... Yeah, the original driver on PlayStation 1, very classic game. Uh, one of the first kind of 3D open world games I can ever remember, especially on console. It wasn't full sandbox because you couldn't just drive around. Well, you could drive around in a car around a city, then that was it. Could you get out of the car? No. Could you wield guns? <laughs> Forget it. But as primitive as it was, it was still a huge moment in gaming history. And it is a very quirky game, a very fun game. Like I say, it's a straight up pastiche of 1970s cop shows, car chase films, things like that. Uh, in the same way that some of the best Bruno Mars songs of the 2010s were straight up pastiches of 70s and 80s, funk and, you know, stuff like that. This, the Driver series, was founded on a love, a deep-seated love of old 1970s car shows and cop shows, you know, car chase movies, things like that, like Bullet, Vanishing Point, Dukes of Hazard, Starsky and Hutch, uh, French Connection, you know, all those old school like car chase, cop chase movies, uh, Bullet, you know, stuff like that. I mean, Bullet is literally the greatest car chase of all time wrapped up in a fairly humdrum Steve McQueen film. So, like, I don't think I've ever actually watched the rest of Bullet all the way through. It's just that 20 minute car chase. But what a car chase. That The driver games are basically that made into a full game. So that came out. I entered the series with Driver 2 back on the streets in... Uh, 1999 or 2000, I want to say. Uh, and that was amazing. Uh, you could get out of the car this time in your sandbox mode. Uh, it still couldn't fire guns or do anything crazy like that. But you could get out of the car and steal other cars. Uh, and you had four cities in that one. One of my first ever PS1 games with two discs. Because uh, it had four cities on it. It had Chicago, uh, Havana in Cuba, Las Vegas, and Rio in Brazil. Driver 2 is November 2000. There you go. Yes. Um, so I, that was where I got into the series. And fun fact, I got that as a present. And then that for Christmas that year, or it might have been, I might have got it for the same Christmas. I got Driver 2 as a present. And then not long after, I was gifted Driver 2 again by someone else. But I was like, oh, shit, I've already got it. Uh, and they were like, oh, I think it was my dad's old friend. So I went, oh, that's okay. I'll return it and get you something else. The replacement was Gran Turismo 2. Very important time in my gaming history that was. So, uh, yeah, early 2001 is where a lot of things kicked off for me. Uh, then there was Driver 3 on the PlayStation 2. <sighs> what could have been one of the greatest games of all time uh, ended up being one of the greatest embarrassments in video game history. Uh, because it was rushed out and uh, AstroTurf review scores and it was very controversial. Yeah, the games industry has never done that again, has it? So, uh, yeah, basically what happens between Driver 2 and 3 is uh, a video game series that started off as 2D top-down uh, called Grand Theft Auto, went, hang on a minute, we, we allow players to run around and shoot guns and do all sorts of crazy shit, but we're doing it in basic top-down micro-machines mode, like bird's-eye view mode, which is kind of limited. This game over here allows you to drive around in full 3D, but you can't really do anything with it. How about we take that and mess it with what we're doing? They made a little game called Grand, uh, Grand Theft Auto 3, and the rest is history. So that came out late 2001 on the PS2. And um, yeah, by the time the next driver game came around, things had to change a lot. Uh, and they went all in on it. They introduced guns. Yeah, there was guns and more open world, like on foot mechanics, uh, an epic sort of cinematic story mode full of Hollywood voice actors. Uh, Michael Madsen voiced the uh, main character, John Tanner. You can see there on the screen grimacing at us. He's like, will you get on with it and stop, start playing this game now? All right, give me, give me a minute, John. John, give me a minute, all right? Um, so in that game, he was voiced by Michael Madsen. Ving Rhames voiced his erstwhile colleague, uh, Tobias Jones, you can see there. 
Uh, he's even got a funky black sidekick. Uh, in the earlier games, that was played up more as a black exploitation thing. Less so now, thankfully. But uh, yeah, it's Tanner and Jones are kind of the body cop duo that have been through most of the driver games together. Um, so yeah, Michael Madsen and Vin Rames were in Driver 3. Iggy Pop was in it. Um, oh God, who else? Who else? There were some big names in that game. But Michelle Rodriguez, I think, voiced one of the villains. Uh, it was a real like cinematic voice cast, licensed soundtrack. All these the cutscenes were amazing. Had this really in depth story mode, um, and yeah, it should have been an astonishingly good game. Except by the time it was, by the time it was late two thousand and four, uh, Atari, who were the publishers at the time, were uh, supposed to be were, were kind of getting cold feet at the fact that since Driver Two, GTA Three had come out and then Vice City, and then by 2005, a little game called GTA San Andreas was about to come out and move the market, like, move the goalposts into another century. So they were like, we've still not got a driver game. Can we fucking wrap this up and get it out there? Whereas the team are like, it's still nowhere near finished. Do you want the best game of all time, or do you want a game out now? And they were like, we want a game out yesterday. Fine then, here you go. Hopefully it'll be all right. Maybe if we pay off enough magazines to give it really good scores, it'll be okay. And then people started playing it and realized it was unfinished and buggy and broken as shit. Uh, and the on-foot shooting mechanics were boring and horrible. And, oh dear. It's really annoying because Driver 3 should have been amazing. The things it gets right, like the actual driving physics, the driving physics in these games, as befits a game series called Driver, have been amazing. The dri they've always had these really heavy, weighty, uh, arcadey driving physics that really feel like you're power sliding big muscle cars around city streets in like those old cop shows, you know, driving down alleyways that always have piles of cardboard boxes in them, you know, all that stuff. The driving physics were amazing in Driver 3. The graphics were awesome when they worked. Like I say, it had that cinematic feel to it, but yeah, the game just wasn't finished. The game just plain was not finished. Um, and coupled with the whole controversy with AstroTurfing for uh, fake review scores, it should have been the death of the franchise right there. Luckily, it soldiered on, and it actually got another game on the PS2 called Driver Parallel Lines, which was kind of like the Tokyo Drift of the Driver franchise, in that it, it didn't have any of the regular characters. It was completely out of the universe. There was no Tanner, no Jones, no uh, you know Jericho, who's the baddie in uh, a lot of the games, uh, including this one. But uh, it was kind of like a soft reboot. You, you suddenly ended up playing some criminal dude in 1970s New York, uh, in a full sandbox now. They went full GTA with that. Um, if I remember rightly, it was it was a pretty good game, but it had this kind of dual time period narrative where you were playing as a criminal in the 70s, riding with this gang, and then at the critical moment, you get thrown under the bus and arrested. Uh, and then you come out of jail in the modern era and go and hunt down all the old people who betrayed you and shoot them in the face. Um, yeah, Skelly, I think, sums it up. It... it it's funny because in many ways it's a much better game than Driver 3. It's more polished. The the shooting mechanics are much better. It's got a lot of interesting concepts about it. It's got like, you know, car customization mechanics. It is full sandbox. It's not like you go through a menu and play missions, but take a ride is a separate sandbox. It's all, it's kind of everything Driver 3 could have been, but it just kind of was a bit late. And like I say, the fact that it did a Tokyo Drift and kind of, completely went somewhere else with the storyline. It had no relation to the other games. I don't know. I remember getting it for Christmas and enjoying it, but not really revisiting it that much. It's a shame, really. But, um, yeah. Then, in 2011, came this. The last Driver game on consoles. Driver San Francisco. Out of nowhere, this popped up on the PS3 and Xbox 360 and PC. And it's not only the best game in the Driver series, it's one of my favorite games of all time. Tanner's back, as you can tell. Jones is back. Jericho's back. All the kind of classic characters from the franchise are back. It's sort of a soft reboot. It has a slight continuity with the other games, but it's also not quite. It's a very different universe. And perhaps the single greatest thing about this game is its central mechanic, which means you can jump in and out of other cars and explore the city as a classic sandbox without physically getting out of your car and walking around. Because basically, I guess, Reflections, the developers and makers of the driver games, basically when it came to make this one, they thought, you know what? We've tried being Diet Grand Theft Auto. It's never quite worked. Because if people want to play a GTA game, they play GTA. 
How about we go back to just being a good driver game? Yes, but it's 2011. You can't be expected to have a game where you just drive around the city and then if you break that car, congrats, you can't get out of it. How about you still can jump into other cars without physically getting out of your car? It's all a bit quantum leap. It's a bit life on Mars. And it's a bit, you know, sci-fi. But it's what I fucking love. I love the TV show Life on Mars and, and its sequel Ashes to Ashes because it was a mix of kind of period cop show meets a bit of sci-fi, a bit of... Yeah, sci-fi. Yeah, it works, though. It really does. We will see that mechanic in full. I think one of the main reasons I love this game so much is when they came up with that core mechanic, it's like they went, how can we have as much fun as possible with this? How can we use this to the best way possible? It's just... Do as much wacky shit as you want with it. Oh, it's just... It's all good. And uh, as a nice bonus, you can see there on the main menu, Tanner's car for this game, yellow and black Dodge Challenger. Potentially my favourite road car of all time. Uh, in fact, hang on a minute. A lot of you will have seen this on the stream already. But here is the little model of his car that comes with the uh, Deluxe Edition, which I actually got back in the day, and I recently got another one. So uh, there's the model of his car, sort of modelled as mid-jump as it's going through, crashing through some newspapers, which actually have, uh, you can't see it on the camera, but there's like newspapers designed to be flying over the car, and uh, they've actually got the cover of the original driver game on them. Lovely, lovely little, oh, and that's just reminding me. Amongst other things, this game may have one of the best Easter eggs of all time. If you know what it is, don't spoil it. We'll get to it. Um, right, let's put it over here. And as Super Mike said, yeah, this is the last driver game up until now. Came out in September 2011, hence why this is the 10th anniversary plays of it. And um, yeah, we've never seen a driver game ever again. There was going to be a follow-up to this game. Uh, Ubisoft decided in their infinite wisdom, because fuck Ubisoft... Uh, that it wouldn't sell a billion, billion, billion units and they couldn't cram it full of microtransactions. Uh, so they turned it into something else. They actually turned it into Watch Dogs. And now Reflections, the people behind the driver games, are in the sort of criterion role of just doing a bit of driving physics on other bigger games and otherwise they just sit in the corner and face the wall while their AAA overlords rinse the game that they worked on for a little bit for all the money in the world. Life on Mars is basically if Doctor Who and Luther had a baby. That's a good way of putting it, actually. Mm. But Super Mike said, best to go out on a high note, and this is it. What a perfect end. If there's never another driver game, what a perfect one to go out on. This is incredible. And uh, speaking of Ubisoft being dickheads, by the way, um, unless you have a box copy of this game for the original consoles, you can't play it. Ubisoft unlisted it from all digital platforms a few years ago and have, have never put it back up. Why? No idea. They've never explained. Licensing issues? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Probably. Who cares? They don't give a fuck. One of the best games they've ever overseen and they don't want you to play it and they don't give a shit about it. I think that says a lot about Ubisoft and how big a bunch of cunts they are. But then again, what should we really expect from the triple A games industry? But either way... Wesley owns it on Steam. Mike's got it on Xbox. Yeah, if you already bought it, then you're good. I already had a box copy on PlayStation 3. I got a fresh copy with that deluxe edition I just got on eBay. It's the game that Ubisoft don't want you to play anymore. And yet it's one of the best games to have ever had their name on it. Logic, right? So let's play it. Let's play it. So here we go. Right. There is a licensed soundtrack, so I've turned the uh, turn the volume down for the music. Let's go into the story. Let's go new game. And here we go. Let's do this. It should be the sex tuple A industry because that's how it makes me feel. Ah! You're not wrong. On some companies being like, no, we should be called the quadruple A industry now because we're just that amazing. And everyone just was just like, oh, fuck off. They want you to forget and buy their new games. Oh, what, you mean the latest edition of Tom Clancy's Murder Terrorist Simulator? KEOC News, your eyes on the city with me, Jessica Adams. Okay. Next up, it's a big day for justice. Convicted cop killer and international smuggling kingpin, Charles Jericho. Oh my God, it's Jericho! Today. 
Oh God, it's Jericho! It's Y2J! It's Y2J, it's Y2J. It's Y2J. Charles Jericho! The mob boss faces. Look at him there! Look at, it's, it's Chris Jericho's dad, I think. Or his older brother. Chris Jericho's older brother, Charles. Tom Clancy's War Crime Olympics. Alright, here we go. Today is a good day. Today the feds are giving me a parade. What's interesting is that in Driver 2, when Jericho debuted, so, he was kind of a goofball strength? sidekick character. He was just the kind of funny hit, dumb meathead hitman for one of the main gangsters. And then in Driver 3, he turned into a really dark character who murdered his boss and shot him in an elevator and took over the crime lord syndicate himself. And ever since then, he's been like the main heel. You got 30 more years in here. I'm asking 30 million. It's not a hard choice. Fine. You're assuming you have the money for it. Somehow I don't find it has Uncanny Valley. Right? Yeah, the CGR, the actual cinematics in this game are excellent as well. So here we go. Well, there's Jericho. He's in prison. Presumably after the events of Driver 3. Although, like I said, it's a little bit loose as to whether it's a direct continuity from Driver 3. And here we are. We're into San Francisco. What a lovely city to face this game, by the way. I mean, San Francisco, iconic in a lot of American movies anyway. I mean, it is the setting of the Bullet car chase. It's, Bullet is set in San Francisco. He be evolving. Yeah. Yeah. He started off as a dumb meathead rock star and then became like the sinister evil heel. And there's our boys. There's Tanner and Jones in that sweet Dodge Challenger. Like I said, probably my favorite road car of all time. It sounds good. All right, game. Mr. Unnamed Officer. You're all over the news. Congratulations. So let's hang it up for today, huh? Come on, John. What do you say, man? Jericho put a bullet in my back. And a lot of good men in the ground. I need to see this. There you thing. go. There's you your link to Driver 3. Go, man. You heard it yourself. Jericho's going down today. So there's your connection. You there is a direct story Be connection to Driver 3. Because at the end of Driver 3, you have a showdown with Jericho. He finally arrests him and shoots him. But then Jericho's like, stay. <laughs> Call an ambulance. Not for me. Bang. And shoots Tanner. And it's a bit like, did Tanner survive? My God. And uh, now we know that he did. And now he's like, fuck you, Jericho. I'm going to see you go down. Da -da -da. Hang on. What was that in Jericho's mouth? Da -da -da. Find out tonight on Monday Night Raw. Look at the cross. 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 So where are we headed? The overpass of 13. Welcome to Monday Night Raw here in San Francisco. You realize once he's locked away, you'll need something new to obsess about, So right? now we're into the game. We are driving now. Stand collecting. Jones, can <laughs> it. I mean, when was the last time you went to a movie or took a girl to a movie? Seriously, Jones. I Look, I'm, he's single, all right? He's happy being single, all right? right? He likes okay, the bachelor partner, life. You loan some gun oh, sorry, uh, sorry, well, excuse me. Sorry. On, Jericho, we are going to live a little. All right, you yeah, we'll it. go for a pint but, after. It's fine. Uh, I wouldn't bring a date back until you've done something with your what? Seriously, it's like a war zone in there. Well, oh, I got video. Oh man, give me a break. <laughs> look, look, I've got my Xbox in the living room. All right, <laughs> there's just a few empty Domino's pizza boxes around the place. That was a razor for blading. <laughs> all right, here we go. Here's the convoy. All right, I've indulged you. <sighs> you know something, partner? Maybe you're right. Oh. Do, do, do. We now go live to the KEOC Eye on the, the City. The Kenny chopper. Everett As Orange County Eye on the City cop chopper. The route the uh oh, uh oh, you look a bit saucy. Every five minutes on SF News. Just keep us right where we are. So presumably somewhere a TV cameraman's just falling out the helicopter like. Let's get <laughs> First round's on me. Oh, we're about to have a point. So uh, why is a random woman in ninja gear in a TV helicopter hijacked a helicopter? Why has she now got an RPG? That's a bit suspicious. That's a bit suspicious, I'll be honest with you. Ah, she's now blown up a police car. All right, all right, shit, shit's getting real. God damn it! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, for fuck's sake. Jones is like, oh, for fuck's sake, I finally got him agreed to go for a beer and now this shit's happening. Jesus Christ. All right, so the escort's been blown apart on the police convoy and now we find out what that thing in Jericho's mouth was. Son of it's a, a pit of acid. Which has melted his... That's ingenious. I'll give him that. That's ingenious. 
30 at 30 on the move to assist officers under fire from a goddamn news chopper. Because we're in motherfucking GTA all of a sudden. <laughs> the players hijacked a helicopter. We really are in Saints Row. So now we're heading off after the, uh, presumably the police van. Which has now been hijacked by Jericho. We need to get the hell out of here now. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, he's not listening to you, mate. He's not listening to you, mate. He's not listening to you, for mate. I think Arca Break should be regular prison truck procedure. Oh. Prison is Jericho. Expect delays. You don't say. All right, well, Tanner's in. It's almost like he knew. It's like, I, I don't trust that he's actually just going to go to jail. Right, anyway, we're off. We're chasing off Jericho in his van. Oi, come back, you prick. I don't believe this. 40 Adams 30 heading east on Fremont in pursuit of Jericho. Requesting backup now. There's some backup over there, but they're not really doing anything. Damn, I was an <laughs> asshole. We can argue about who was the bigger asshole after we catch that Yes. Bastard. I like your attitude, Tanner. Right, not, not now, Jones. Not now. Well, Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, my G's got infinite mass on that police van. All right. Oh, let's just observe the sexiness of our challenger. What? Let's just... I love the fact we're having to drive around the traffic. Jericho's like, fuck that, I'm driving straight through it. Oh, shit. D oops. <laughs> hey, broke it up, John. Okay, I'm, I'm good. I'm trying to remember the controls. Right, circle's handbrake. Triangle is... Uh... Ow. I'm, I'm doing my best. Yeah, that was the plan. I'm doing as first as I can. Jericho has hacks. Wait, lads, where are you going? Jericho's over here. Need you. Jericho's traffic check. Yeah, he's playing Burnout Revenge out here. Um, would you... Can we... Would you stop that? Right, anyway. Some plebo just getting our way there. Right, we're in an alley. Where, where's he gone? Where, where's he gone? Hey, he went down that alley. I see it. You see the alley? Yes. Dodge Neon. Yes. Uh, I, I don't think he went down this alley, mate. Jones, you're now 0-2 for successful predictions today. Oh, man, what you worrying about? No, nothing's going to happen to Jericho. He's not going to... Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, never mind. He went down that alley. Oh, no, he didn't. Where'd he go? <laughs> Jones, you're not doing... Oh, oh for fuck's sake. Oh, Welcome drive, to drive. San Francisco is Jericho. <laughs> oh, my God. Right, we're now... Uh -huh. We're now playing Damn. first person. Yeah. Son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. This is terrifying. Jericho with the sneak attack, yeah. He's run up behind us with a steel chair. Hey, he's ramming our challenger. I don't oh no. Oh that, that's a road. That's a road. We're being shunted into a road. Look what he's done to our nice car. Look what he's uh oh. Ow! Clearly, that was going to refill your local CCPF. SO. Where's that deep fit, Ray? Come on. Roblox oh god. Come back to us, buddy. Charging your 250. Jack, don't you do this to me. Jones is there just like, for fuck's sake, you've nearly died about three times already in the series. Can we not do this again? <sighs> now what's happening? Tanner. 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 Damn. Man, I got I got no idea how we lived through that. I saw where he went. <laughs> what? Hey, come on, man. We gotta get you to do a hospital. No, no. Jericho's got a head start. <laughs> du -du -du. Du -du -du. Jericho's now sending messages on the Titan Tron. Right, man? Yeah, fine. We're in the ring and he's on Let's the Titan Tron. <laughs> Ominous crows. Right now where are we going? Take it easy, man. You don't look so good. I said I'm fine. We've He's like a true wrestler. Now. He's working through Damn a concussion. Boston, he really shouldn't. Where are you taking him? Look at I know where he went. Did All units in the vicinity of Fillmore, we need urgent ambulance escort. Critical RTA. Okay, so square is current jet. Triangle is hey, zooming a bit on the main map. So, things are a bit weird. The color filter has changed. We can now hear a defibrillator going off in the background. 
You hear that? You're what? Yeah, you're the wall. Seriously, man, you okay? Fine. <laughs> I'm fine, I can just hear a defibrillator. Damn traffic! Come on already, drive faster, Ray! I'm going as fast as I can, Ricky. Wait, whoa! Uh Jones? Man, you look like crap. <laughs> oh cheers! Thanks. We not go this way. Oh. Well we can't go we can't go this way yet, hang on. Let's go this way instead. So, um, yes, yeah, weird shit's now happening. Working with concussion, otherwise known as the ECW. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're not wrong. All right, so things are starting to get very weird. We got T-boned by a, a, a petrol tanker, presumably on its way to the nearest ah, BP garage. Uh, and suddenly we've woken up, our car's fine, but now there's a funny filter on the screen and um, Tanner can now hear a defibrillator going off in his head. So, yeah, things are a bit, things are a little bit strange. And there's Jericho's van, he's got some crows. Gee, I, I didn't realize this. I didn't, I don't remember this period where Jericho teamed up with Sting. Okay. Damn it! He's gone, man. How the hell did he do that? He's Vince McMahon. He's faked his own death. Whoa. The limo expo- Oh. Hey, you all right? Steady. That guy's in pretty bad shape back there. Oh, whoa. Okay, well, this... I think this migraine's really... It's raven. Gee, this migraine's having a... Man, this migraine is... Now what the fuck? Damn it, Ray! What the hell are you doing? What are you stopping for? Where the hell? I'm in the ambulance. No shit, genius. <laughs> we got a head trauma in the back and the ER... Is yeah! So, um... Eyes on the city, Ray. Come on, let's go. I'm Ray? Come on, Ray. <laughs> I love Gas the fact the guy in the passenger seat. Because, yeah, yeah, this okay. is this is what's we happening. This. We're doing some quantum leap shit. Partner, where to? As far as Tanner knows, he's now randomly driving an ambulance. Except to everyone else, he's now just in the body of the man driving the ambulance. So when he's like, I'm, I'm Ray, I'm not Tanner, what the, hell the guy in the happening? passenger seat's like, yeah, you You're fucking Ray. ambulance what? driver, and it's called stress. <laughs> Any more <dumb> questions? <laughs> yeah. How the hell did I get You here? went through medical Just school, for fuck's sake. Get on with it. So, uh, yeah. The ambulance was ready in the cuts. Look. Is our best bet. Uh, which way? You cannot be serious. I am yeah, serious, and don't I mean, call me Shirley. No. St. Giles, yeah, you got it. Always the damn comedian. Now drive. Look, pal, driving, I can do. Driving, I can do that, even though I'm, I'm in someone else's body. If you say so. You ain't ever driven like this before. Well, I'm doing my best, mate. This can't be real. Out the way. Hey, hey, listen to me, Ray. I know we've been pulling some crazy hours lately, but you've got to focus. Do drive as fast as I can. Okay. Right, out the way, ramp truck, which will come in use later. We're at the hospital. I know. Not Ray Krugel. I know. There we go. We're good. I oh, know it's our racing evolution. <laughs> nice work, Ray. You were like a man possessed. Oh, God. Spoiler alert. He was. What's happening to me? Do it again. Do it again. The Titantron. Do what again? I mean, did I do it or? Hey, that's my car. Jones? Jones! <laughs> Jones! Out of those, I'd say the chop shop about three blocks from here. You remember the one, right? If Jericho's gonna show up Benny. anywhere, it's probably. Hey, Jones? <laughs> Jones? <laughs> what the fuck? What? Yeah, it's me. Back. What? Back to um, oh, forget it. I'm, I'm fine. I mean, I'm really not fine. Are you sure? That was a big hit we took back there. Maybe we should get you checked out. I'm, I'm fine. Nah. Look, I don't need now? to do a concussion check. The chop shop? You're right. That's the best. I mean, I've been got. concussed straight into quantum leap, leap, but you know. You ever notice that billboard, no. Jones? Opposite the hospital, the one that says, "Do no. it again." No. That yes. viral marketing campaign. Really? Funny, I, I've never seen it before. Who gives a? <laughs> Look, what is it with you? Sure, we had a near miss back there, but we've got a murdering scumbag to reapprehend. Yeah, look, I, I'm going. To, I'm doing as best I can. All right. Things are a bit weird right now. Okay. Oh, down down an alleyway. There's no boxes, but there are roadworks to smash through. I'll take. Ah, oh, there's the boxes. Damn it. Never mind. Excuse me. Sorry. Excuse me. Pardon me. Has the old 70s tire squeal. Oh, yeah, it does. All right. Now, where are we? 
Give me a good. Do it, Tanner. Says uh, Jericho up on the Titan Tron. that sign? Do it, Tanner? Man, that billboard's been there for years. Oh, this is too freaking weird. Okay, I'm gonna try it I'll tell again. you what, Raven and Jericho are really combining me, fuck sure with us right now. But here goes. Or Sting. <gasps> How am I up here? Oh my god. I'm not falling. I gotta get down. Okay, focus, focus. There. Okay. Yeah. So now who we landed in? Well, we're in Dodge dead. Neon. Of all the cars I'm in the not... city you could have picked, Tanner, you Easy. picked this one. Now, uh, yeah, can we do it again and get out of this car? Press X to shift. All right, I will. Oh, oh so God. you didn't mean shift as in change wheel. gear. You meant as in change car. Okay. okay. So uh, now we just jumped into this Cadillac. Okay. And then, boink, we go over here. We can be okay. in this bus. Just pick another do -do 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 I'm okay. Maybe try something with a passenger. Okay. Talk to somebody. Oh, we'll. All right. How about we go over here? Okay. I'm beginning to get the hang of this. Never flagged down a taxi like this. All right. Hello. Oh, yes. Keep it down, buddy. Just drive the cab. Huh. Uh, right. Hi, I'm the driver. Quit yapping. Name and drop. Get me across town. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Name I'm drop. Just the same guy I always was. I mean that he always was. Were. <laughs> Who? What? Whatever. Uh, okay. Yeah. No. So that's the wacky part of this game. You could. What the. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, there's a very nice Ford GT there. Oh man, now that's more my style. This is a city mission. They unlock Tanner missions, help the people. Aha, so that's. These are how the side missions happen in this game. This is a car, sir, that says I have arrived. And I came much faster than you. <laughs> but it's so damn powerful. When am I going to drive a monster? Is, is, like is that this? something you really want to say to people? Is, I came much faster than you did. But hey, ladies. Did, who did you? Wants to go for I, a I wasn't spin? asking about that. <laughs> Okay, so now we've got this random lad who's taking a Ford GT for a test drive, and your man in the the, the man in the passenger seat is like, "Sir, this is an amazing car. You'll love it." But he's just sort of trundling around at 30 miles an hour. So Tanner's going to jump in his body and show him how a car like this really should be driven. Oh yeah, this is the real deal. Way too much grunt for a greenhorn. I could get us into some serious trouble. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm just going to floor it. Yes. Okay? Go right ahead. Well, if you say so. <laughs> well, if you say so. All right, overtake 10 vehicles. Well, there's one. Um, does it count if they're on the wrong side of the road? Yes, it does. Ow. Yeah, you'll right be out. fine. Please, can I take it from your exuberant driving? You'll be putting down a deposit. Mm, still thinking yeah, about we, it. we really need to see how it does in the corners first. And, you know, whether it will actually start when I well, put the key I'm in in the morning. Yet. Somewhere I'm Jeremy Clarkson is getting war flashbacks. Unrails, sir. Unrails, huh? On Just rails, you say? Okay, hang on. Oh, no, no. Whoops, that's the shift button. That's not handbrake, Gage. Hey. Okay. So, round here. Out the way. Excuse me. Sorry. Sir, this car Pardon me. Oh, yeah, also. <laughs> nice touch in this game. But hey, <laughs> crowd scatter. <laughs> yep, I'm not hitting any of the pedestrians. Because <laughs> this is not an R-rated game. <laughs> It's actually quite a cheesy old school game, so you can't run anyone over. They all mystically jump out the way. So I think it's brilliant, to be fair. Again, trying to be the anti-GTA. If you want to go running over people in the street and then blowing everything up and stealing cars and everything like a regular criminal, you just play GTA. Why would you play Driver for something different? Which is some of the great, what the great thing that this game really kind of embraced. It's like, we've spent too long trying to be Diet GTA. How about we go back to being driver? Whoops, I can't keep doing that. This up. Oh, sorry, like this. Uh, excuse me. Uh, there we go. Uh, just once uh, around the uh, sorry, I'm, I'm still figuring this out. This, this, this rare form of schizophrenia is uh, really fucking with my head. It's just like Art Rally. You know, in a way. The cheap plastic engine start button breaks. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Okay, bonk, whoops. May have hit a, a, a telephone, <laughs> public payphone there. Excuse me. And also, because this is an old school 70s cop show, everything at the side of the road is made of plastic. So uh, everything's breakable. Jump 10 meters within this zone, okay. And, oh, this looks like 
the road suddenly drops like we could go this. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Let's head to to, uh, discuss payment you, uh, yeah. Uh, no. X is not handbrake. Okay, we need to get through this. We need to figure this out. Oh, hello. You go up here back to the showroom. Oh, you know what I was saying about Tristan Hanley? Yes. It's better. Oh, yeah. Whoops. Hang on. Right, so brake. Turn in. Get the apex. Yo, oh, it wants to spin the back end now. And then round. And then left. Yeah, you see? This is a proper road test. He's getting his Jeremy Clarkson on now. As you can see, the car's a bit wayward when you're coming out of the corners because there's 550 horsepower under my right foot. I've got the power of freedom under my right foot. Oh, oh, we've come at it from the wrong angle. Okay. You used to negotiate tight corners. What? The brake. Okay. Brake and the steering. Okay. So now we're doing the downhill version. It's like Pike's... It's like diet... I wanted, I wanted Pike's Peak on Wish.com, and this is what I got. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Squealing tires. And then down and out the other side. Oh, hey, this is fun. Are you having fun? I'm having fun. <laughs> the salesman's just like, I, I regret the moment. <laughs> I regret the moment I agreed to a test drive with this nutter. Power. Excuse me. Now out the way. For once, I'm playing a game where I say out the way, and they actually do get out of the way. Brilliant. Brilliant. All right, come on. Speed. Speed. Oh, do a shortcut here over the pavement. Sorry. Excuse me. Out the way. All right, so that's the look around. So L3 is born. Driver scoot, Francisco. Speed. Speed. We're doing 190 miles an hour at the finish line. Oh, yeah. Hey, do you reckon it floats? Sir, I have a dozen employees and two ex-wives. The support payments alone, you are such <laughs> a buzzkill. So, uh, you know what I said about having fun with the core mechanic? Getting a bit of a sense with it. Getting a bit of sense of it already. There's an even better one coming up shortly. All right, so... Oh, man, this is awesome. Weird, but awesome. <laughs> Weird, but awesome. <laughs> what a great way oh, of describing God. this game. Where... Where the hell's my car? Hang on. Where the hell's my body? <laughs> I've got to try and find Jones. All right, hang on. The driver's... Oriel. Yeah, you know, yep. All right, where's... Oh, there's my car. Oh, come on. What's the deal ah. here? San Francisco needs a hero. San Francisco just like, I need a hero. I need a hero till the end of the night. Okay, so kind of like Saints Row, you have to do side missions. What the hell am I supposed to do now? You have to do a certain amount of side missions to unlock story missions. Hold on. Oh, hello. Those voices, they're coming from that patrol car. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, why not? You want me to help people? I'll help yeah, you. fuck you. <laughs> I like how Tano's like a... a, like a what do you call it? Passive-aggressive teenager with the billboards. Oh, you want me to help car. them, will you? Help oh, fuck it. I will I then. <laughs> Jericho's just like, all right, then, yeah, do that. All right, let's jump into this. Stick with them, Bob. I'm trying, I'm trying. Any luck with the no, radio? No. Nah, the mic's busted. We can't call for backup. I guess we're on our own. Just pray someone's watching over us. I always feel like someone is watching me. And I'm, and I'm going to have a Tanner take over my body. Oh, whoa. Oh. He's got to be strong. He's got to be fast. And he's got to be driving a car. What the? The getaway has a heat zone. Stay in the zone and stop him. Leave the zone for 10 seconds and he escapes. This is a nice touch as well. In car chase missions, right, it actually car shows car on the map the, the distance that you need to stay with him for the target car. So, uh, normally in games, it's just like a vague sort of... The car gets a bit far ahead, and it's like, you failed! It's like, I can still see him. Like, for fuck's sake. Uh, also, I'm... Um, this, this is a tough decision for me. Because that's the Chevelle SS. Another one of my favourite cars of all time. I'm, I'm going to have to smash it up. And I, I'm, I'm really sorry about this. I'm very sorry about this. I do approve of your choice of getaway car. But, you know, I'm just doing my job, you know? 
I didn't choose this life. I really didn't. <laughs> Actually, I'm... Oh! Oh! Absolute annihilation. We have kind of destroyed that poor Chevelle. Now that's how to catch a felon. Hot pursuit one. Oh, yeah. I always feel like somebody's driving me. <laughs> right, return to Tanner's car. All right, I will. Go over here. There we go. Well, I'm back. Look, look, John, you're angry. I get that. I am too. But the stony silence routine is where <laughs> so many real thin. Tanner's just sat in the car. Track Jericho down before he has time to And Jones is like, what the fuck? Are you, you're not even listening to me. And Tanner's like, uh, 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 sorry, what were you on about? Yeah, whatever. Jones, hey, Jones. You <laughs> Why are you shouting at me? I'm so sat next to you. Again, huh? You shut up for so long, I figured you got brain damage. Or were you just trying to add something up without using your finger? Oi! Okay, <laughs> Shut up, I know my math GCSE wasn't done, that man. good. Sorry, must have dropped out there for a moment. Quit zoning out on me, man. Sorry, you, you're you. gonna have to deal with a certain amount of zoning out. I have ADHD. Okay. I mean, no. Jericho's loose. Um, we don't know where. What else? Well, we know his escape wasn't a You don't say. There was that there was right. that ninja woman in the helicopter with an RPG. Of hitting a moving target from a chopper with an RPG. Ex-military? Probably. <laughs> Pilot says it was a chick. Dark hair, sense of style. Man, that has to narrow. Down. Dark hair and a sense of style. Five We're in San Francisco. I, th I think there's quite a few stylish women in San Francisco so with dark hair. Start turning over some garbage and see where the roaches Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay, let's talk names. What about Jimmy Herrera? San Quentin. Ordell Williams? Cut a break. He's out on parole. Not much, but it's a start. Ooh, okay. So we're going to do some old school detective work. We're at the precinct. Sense of style. Okay, she was a babe wearing tight fitting clothes, right? Oh, meanwhile, yeah. back on the Titan Tron. Find Jericho. That's what I got to focus on. What is wrong with you? Isn't that what we've just been saying? Yeah, Jones, look, listen, mate. <laughs> okay. You're not. Jericho case board. Start from you're, scratch. You're going to have to stop taking Jericho's everything I say and do well very literally. All right? Probably ex military. He's still out there. Right. Someone knows so the case starts with uh, Jericho. That, that's it. So we, we have no leads to him to or anything else. Him. Maybe with this, this thing, thing I can do, we've got the edge. This thong. <laughs> this thong I can do. Right. Do -do 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 -do. Right. See you later, Jones. Enjoy talking to a mannequin for a few more hours. Dun -dun -dun. Meantime, this is what's actually happening in Tanner's life. He's sat in the hospital. Listening to the news. Jones is vibing in the corner like, Oh, you're still ignoring me then? I'm literally in a coma, fuck off. Shift level two. Zoom out or zoom in. Maybe if I could hop Whoa. a building or a hole. Okay, so you do that. Whoa. We'll do that. So down at row level, you can then pop up to do. Okay, you can't. There we go. Get to the dare. It's dare. So, speed dare. Drive 800 meters in 45 seconds. No hits. From the bong? And we're in a Dodge Neon. We're, we're on a Dodge Neon, for fuck's sake. Bring the best car for the job. I mean, th that's not the best car for the job. Patently, that's a pretty good car for the job. I refuse to go to my violin lesson today. Well, that's okay. I was planning on going somewhere else anyway. Yeah, it works for me. Rather nice modern Dodge Charger. From a classic Dodge to a modern one. Maybe Tanner's Dodge is a resto mod. And there we go, that was easy. <laughs> Driving a straight line for some distance without crashing. Even I can do that. Right, anyway, bye. You can go off to your violin lesson now. Willpower currency. You've earned some willpower. Ah, the days where modern games had in-game currencies that they didn't immediately try and monetize up the arse. Everything you do earns willpower. God, I, w I wish my brain actually worked like this. Spend it in your garages, yes. New vehicles available to buy. Oh, okay. Modern for the time, yeah. We're just floating over the city. Just by being along, and we're gonna go to our garage. We're gonna go to the garage area. Drive to a hotspot to repair your car. 
by vehicles and upgrades. Okie doke. Enter garage. I will. Vehicles. So you can buy all of these cars so you can just access them when you want. Was that a Chevelle wagon? Very possible. Okay, so there's not many to choose from for the moment. So we've got an Alfa Romeo 159Ti. It's all right. An Audi TT. A Cadillac DTS. A Charger SRT8 or a Challenger SRT8. Unfortunately, we can't afford the Challenger yet, but uh, Ford Crown Victoria or a GT. Ford Crown Victoria. Uh, Nissan 370Z. We can't afford that either. Uh, Pontiac. Solstice or a Trans Am. And that's it. So, what have we got on the... There's not really much to do. We might as well buy a Charger. We just had one. Yeah, we'll just buy a Charger. Cha-ching! There we go. New vehicle available. Select vehicle. Why not? And when these unlock, you can buy stuff with willpower with these as well. Upgrades are ability upgrades to use with your uh, quantum leap powers. And challenges are what they say on the tin. So, uh, exit the garage. Let's go. Like I said, we've barely even... We've barely even explored it, like a tenth of the possibilities with this mechanic, and we're already having a load of fun with it. Get income from cars and garages. The income is awarded every 20 minutes. Buy more items to earn more income. There you go. There's a little bit of a GTA thing there with like the passive income mechanic. And now we've got a new charger. Nice. Try the activity you unlocked. So I will. What else is going on? I will. <laughs> immediately buys a car, immediately dumps it. So who's driving it? Does that mean just someone something goes mew, just pulls to the side of the road and someone looks in the car like there's, there's no one in the car. This is weird. <laughs> what? There's a ghost car. It's an Oldsmobile. Same thing, yeah. Well, Oldsmobile and Chevrolet were part of GM, so. Right, let's go over here. What have we got? Complete the checkpoint route to earn willpower. I will. To earn willpower. We can hire willpower to drive for our IndyCar team. Oldsmobile is a dead GM brand, like Buick, you mean? I mean, no, wait, Buick isn't dead. Play in any vehicle, complete to unlock cars, we play active. Okay, so, right. We're going to do a checkpoint race. Let's do this. Oh, we brought our charger with us. Where we go. Aha, yeah, the quicker we complete this, check this uh, race, the more willpower we get at the end of it. You see? Top left there. Bonk. And then, they're mostly going in a straight line for the moment, so. Do, 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 do. Oops. Uh, oh, oh, this is getting quite busy. Mm -hmm. Right, and now we've got, oh no, we've got to turn left. It's like NASCAR, we've got to turn left. <laughs> and like a lot of modern NASCAR drivers, we failed at turning left. Oh, we've got to turn left. We're into turn two. We'll have to get out of the way. Stupid wagon. <laughs> Stupid wagon. Anyway, okay, we're fine. We survived turning left twice. We're a NASCAR driver now. Oh, Mark Laren Senna's here. Oops, and I've just crashed because I was distracted by Mark Laren Senna's message, but it's okay. I can't really blame him for that. Sorry I'm late. Been celebrating my brother's 45th lap around the sun. Happy birthday to your brother, Mark. I wonder if the value of willpower is like 12 cents. This is the era of charge you use in NASCAR. It is. I miss dodging NASCAR like everyone else. Then again, I missed NASCAR when NASCAR was good. Oh, we're back in. Uh, we're back in our actual body now. Dun, dun, dun. Huh. Okay, so. Whoa! What the? Okay. All right, so Tanner's still fucking around with his mind powers. And then, just smash. Oh, Bruno, take down. Then we'll jump into another car. Chasing after a Lamborghini Countach. In a Corvette. Tanner, I love your choice of cars. It's been Dodgy's or Chevrolet so far. Big fan. Look at there. He's like, yeah, power sliding. And now I'm driving a truck. Just smash. And then we're back in our own car. And Jones is just like, what the fuck? What the fuck are you playing at, sir? 
Look, listen, it, it's it's quite difficult to explain. You're gonna have to come with. You, you're gonna have to stick with me here. With this new thing I can do, I've got the keys to the. Hell yeah, you have. So downtown garage. That's the fisherman's wharf garage. Uh, we could buy a Gran Torino from there, but we're not going to. So if you look on the map, we've got like activities and missions and stuff marked in yellow and black. But there's also stuff like. We look here on the map, there's little blue dots moving around. They're cars that you jump in and immediately do stuff with. So, there's a police car there that we j we can jump in and we immediately start a police pursuit. Meantime, let's go up here where there's another blue dot on the map. What's that? Is that a police car or... It is a... It's another police car. Yeah, that's another police car. Ford Crown Victoria. Very nice. Um, there are also, some of these blue dots are actually getaway cars as well, so you can do the opposite. So if we go over here, that's another police car. Oh, hello. Oh, no, that's, uh, markers for film stunts of certain things. Aha, you collect a certain amount of those by doing ramp jumps and stuff. And they unlock special movie-themed challenges, which are very cool. Uh, that's another police car, so we're not going to do that. Aren't the blue dots just cop cars? No, sometimes they are, uh... Other pickups like that. And sometimes... That was a Caddy Escalade police car. Sometimes they are actual getaway cars. So if you see a car chase in uh, happening... What's this over here? Aha! Stunt there before a 30 meter jump. So... Is there a full map? Yes, there's a full map. Okay, here's the full map. Movie tokens. That's the one. Okay, so... The padlock is presumably the next story mission, which we need to do side missions first to unlock. So, this is a city mission. They unlock Tanner missions as well as activities. And it's a late 80s Camaro 7 Z28. We're driving. I'm doing it. Meet the heat. Lose the cops and meet with Jericho's gang. Oh, here we go. I was just saying about a getaway. We can't leave the cops with this meat. Why not? Jericho's guys will take care of them. They You're driving a Camaro, mate. That's not the ass? attitude to take and in a police chase. Jimmy's gonna kill us. We gotta shake him ourselves. Alright, let's go. Alright, I'm driving a Camaro, motherfucker. We're doing this. We out here. Move this car, Darius. Oh, it's, it's a blue. It's a blue Camaro. It's the murderer Camaro. Whoa, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Oops. Alright, things have not gone things things well to well start with. Uh, hang on. Are you on you Mate, you have no idea what I'm on today. You, I'm on a madness. What I'm on now is a madness. Which means I can do things like this. Meantime, oh shit! No! You gotta be careful. But yeah, that's another way we can fuck around with mind powers. Shit! Shut up, I've got this! <laughs> I've got this under control, alright? Whoops! Ow! <laughs> okay. Things are not going with Crunch. Things are not... Oh, hello. Things are suddenly going all right. Is this the actual murder Camaro they used in Top Gear? Because it's slow as shit. Oh, fuck. Never mind. That is a legitimate strategy. Use other cars as weapons. do 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 There we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, shit, where's our car? No, where's our car? There, uh, there it is. Go! 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 It was a boss. But go! Shit! Okay, it's not... D damn it, that's not works. You need to go a bit further up the road for that. Ow! Someone's in... Please cause up our anus again. Ow! Do something, Darius. I'm trying as best as I can. You hear, you hear. Right, let's go back to the old school driver way, which is weave between there, traffic. Gotta give these cops the slip first. This is a classic... The no, I meant... The police cars hit the traffic, not me. All right, okay. Got two minutes to lose the coppers. All right. You never take me alive, coppers. Oh. Okay. Wow. This is the slowest thing in recorded history. I may as well be driving an actual boat right now. Never mind. Let's go on the wrong side of the road and we. Yeah, we can't even head for the meetup while we've got cops on our. I'm head. working on it. All right. And boys are gonna Have you got any bright up. ideas over there? Trust me, we're gonna make the meeting. Have you got any bright ideas? Oh, hello. Where are they? Oh, they're all on the other side of the road. 
Losing the cop. Oh, hang on, we're losing the cop. No, what have I done? I've jumped in a random van. Where's our car? Where are you going? Oh, you blithering idiot. You blithering idiot. Actually, this may have... No, it's not worked. All right, this, this is a... <laughs> Tanner's got all British driving on the left side. You, you noticed? We're gonna miss the meeting, Shut up. You gotta drive or we're dead. You, you're not helping at all. Are you aware of how little you're helping right now? Right, we go up here. We go up here. They can't handle turns. So, go. 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 There's a, there's a flaw in my strategy. This car can't handle turns either. <laughs> Cubes. It's... <laughs> You gotta do better. Where you, you stop talking already? And you've had some bad rashes in your time. It's good. Right, okay, here we go. Hijack the bus. Fuck you. No. Shit. Right, you. This is not going well. Damn, boy, you can really drive when you gotta make it. Thank happen. you. Finally, put some respect on my name. Right, I've had enough of this. Right. I'm sorry, we're going to have to sacrifice another tomorrow. Sunday, Fuck them. Right. Sake. It's because the police cars are so close to. Ow! This ain't right, God damn it! I think we might be about to lose this mission. I'll be, I'll be quite honest with you. Right, fire truck. Last minute fire truck. Good! <laughs> There we go. That's what I've been trying to do all mission. Beetle, come on. Come on, Beetle. Fuck. <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> Damn it. That's all? Damn it? Unless I beg, right? Shut up. People gonna do <laughs> that didn't happen. It's great. 180 horsepower. Move this car, all right, we out here. Let's go. If the cops grab us, I'm looking at five years. Well, that'd be a real tragedy for the rest of San Francisco. <laughs> Man, I feel alive. Right, this time now, oh, fire trucks has gone. Never mind. Right, you. Ford F-150. It's a Ford. No one cares. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, I've actually wrecked right. my own car. Worse than that. Right, go, go. Leg it. They're all stuck behind a truck. No, no, they're not. No, they're not. Because they're driving the slowest car mankind has ever seen. It didn't have that much horsepower to start, and now it's got even less. Right, quickly, fire truck. Go. Go, fire truck. Go, fire truck. Do, 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 do. Fuck you! <laughs> Suddenly, rogue fire truck has intercepted the chase. This is not going well. No! No! no Jesus Christ! <laughs> All right, come on, give me, give me something. Oh, never mind. The humdrum candle. Ah! How did I miss all of them? <laughs> All right, we need to... Right, we're, we're on the right lines, though. You see my strat now. Damn, <laughs> doing my best out here. I'm doing my best in these streets. Right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay. <laughs> You're there we go. <laughs> Someone in the passenger seat's like, dear, are we going to the pin... Are we going to the bingo or not? And then something... That's sexist. Also, fuck off. Fine, try Fire truck, fire truck, fire truck, fire truck, fire truck. Right, you, you, <laughs> fuck's sake. Right, these tracks aren't really good. Why are you? Why is it? <laughs> Look, the land that we've jumped inside, clearly not a very good driver. As soon as we leave him unattended for five seconds. Right, fuck it. Let's, let's just ram the clock cars ourselves. Keep moving, we gotta shake them. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's nice work. Uh, is there anyone? You'll do. Right, yo. Fuck. Yes! We got one of them. We had to ram other cars into the police car. But we're doing this. Right, let's go on the other side of the road. Can you stop ramming me? <laughs> stop nudging me. That's getting very annoying. We're in heavy traffic on the highway. But that also means... There's a boss! Do -do 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 -do. Uh, yeah, I know what you mean, Oriel. That's not unlocked yet. I know what you mean, though. Ow! 
Right, well, luckily, we're just sort of outlasting everything out, every, all of other police cars just on pure stamina alone. Just because they're ramming themselves to death trying to, meat, trying to destroy us. They're sacrificed. No, out the way! Right, fuck it. Uh... Uh, uh, never mind. We'll, we'll go with th uh, this. Right, you, you. Fuck, fuck you. Why is the AI turned around? Right, fuck it. Lori. Driving is so much safer here in America. Well, I got some bad <laughs> Well, it was you. until you met me. Oh, God. Oh, God. Fuck you. Look out. You. You totally yeah, I have. Out. Brilliant, isn't it? Right, fuck you! Smash! Here we go, shit's getting real now. <laughs> They're now spinning each other out, fuck you! Yes. Annihilate fools! Annihilate it! Out of the way! You! Die! You! No, we're not! You're fine, stop being dramatic! You! <laughs> Nudge! You! We may run out of time here, but still, you can. Where are you going? Oh, go on. We could kill both of them here. We could still kill both of them. Right, we need to throw the Hail Mary. We've got a boss. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go for the boss, let's go for the boss. Yes! Yes, we got one of them. What about the other? What about the other? Where is the other one? Cubes, pube nuggets, go. No! No! God damn it! No! Damn it. That's, that's all I said. That's Damn what it. I said to him. Unless I beg, right? Jericho's people gonna... Right, we're getting there. We're getting there, okay? Move this car, Darius. If the cops drive all right, us, stop. I'm looking... Right, let's just not fuck around with this. We don't have to listen to this toolbox. Oh, we can't drive me to police car now, can we? All right, never mind. Right, yo, can we, tow <laughs> can we tow the police cars? Spoiler alert, you technically can't... Oh, hello. Bus. Right. do 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 don't ram into me. There we go. Right, you. Uh, what the? What are you doing? You blithering idiots. <laughs> You're really not good at this, aren't you? <laughs> Fuck's sake. Ram. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> damn it. Damn it. <laughs> Can we get a damn it counter? Bag, right? yeah. Can we get a damn it counter? Move this car, Darius. No, do you want to try driving this or what? That'd be a real tragedy for the rest of the Do you want to try driving this or what? You're not. You're not helping it. You're really just not helping in any way. I hope you understand this. Ah, fuck's sake! But you, this go, 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 go. Why have I round my own car? Of the four cars I could have hit there, I round my own car. Damn it, counter three. <laughs> More dams than a freaking Farouk promo. Damn! <laughs> Find the cop always gotta be there just as it's going down. It's like I'm cursed. Ordell, believe me, today is your lucky day. <laughs> Duh, sir. Hang on. Oh my god, this 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 could be okay, absolute no. no. For fuck's Herman? sake. <laughs> and that's funny as say. Uh, Why? Funny. Why? Sake. Stupid! Ugh. Right. You, you'll do. Ford F-150. Go on. Now, all of you, you, would you... Would you stop that? Sake. Uh, right, okay. Right, go. Yeah, another F-150. That'll do. That'll do. Right. Speed! Bollocks. Please, like, there's a lot of suicide. There's a lot of kamikaze cars out on the road today. Right, you, fuck off. You, I'm just nudging them. With the, there's a beetle. Right. Some guy in an Alfa Romeo is now our car's guardian angel. Fuck off. Fuck off. F fuck off. There we go. Block them off. Um, You will go. Right, you'll go. And then. For fuck's sake. They have some. They have some sun handy. They really do, don't they? All right, we'll sacrifice a Pontiac Trans Am for the, for the greater good. The, oh, you! Fuck up! We'll ram you anyway. Just pick them off. One by one. Goal! <laughs> it's a goal! 
Oh god! Oh for fuck! Why is there always a car in the wrong spot? Why? Why is this always happening? I love the fact I've just given up trying to drive our own car anymore. Okay, we go. We go. Yes! There we go. Fuck you. That was one. We'll take that. Oh, ramp truck. Is it too close? No, it's not. Fuck you! Oh my god, why? Why is our man so hopeless at driving cars? You're supposed to be a driver, aren't you? No, I, wait a minute. I'm the driver. Okay, that makes more sense. Right, here we go. Sacrifice to Dodge Neon. Nothing of value will be lost to society. Nothing at all. Oh, another ramp truck. Oh no, it's, a, it's an oil tanker. I've never had a job like this before. No, we need to deliver you know this what? to BP, <laughs> BP Dartford. No, more important shit's happening right now. Why is our guy so useless? Why is our man so useless? Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Fuck, right, one of you. There's three of them, mate. There's three of them. How do we keep missing all of them? <laughs> There's the ramp trucks. Like, what the, what the fuck just happened? All right, let's move them onto the other side of the road and then just fire random plebs at them. Right, random pleb number one. You... What? For God's sake! Why have you stopped? Hmm. Right. Bus. We'll see what we can do with that. One of the cop cars is nearly dip. <laughs> Has a police car just crashed into a bus by accident? Fuck you! We're about to get nicked again, aren't we? We're, we're literally about to get nicked again because the guy in the driver's seat is literally a toaster in human form. How, how do you... This is one of the first missions in the game. This is one of the first missions in the game. The old driver tactic driving down alleyways. We might have to do that. We might just have to go old school on them. We're nearly there, but we gotta Oh no! Oh, lose the, right. the cops! Lose the cops! Come on, keep going, keep going! Shit! Keep you going, keep going! Keep, keep. No, Damn fuck. it! That's all? Damn it! Damn it, counter four! I beg, right? Jericho's people gonna do Right, I think this time we go old school. No more messing around with mind powers. We just outdrive the we try and outdrive the cops in our shopping trolley with a Chevrolet badge on it. Did someone say something about an alleyway? Yes. All right, let's go down the alleys. Let's go old school. Tanny, you know how to do that, right? Oh, hello. Well, hey! Hey, there you go. And then we go this way. <laughs> oh, that police car righted itself. I was really hoping we'd have taken out that police car by flipping it. Right, out in the open roads is not a good strap. That's not an alley. Why have you got such like shit-tasting getaway or cars? I mean, come on. Today is your lucky day. I mean, honestly. Damn. <laughs> we fucking have got Farouk in the passenger seat, you know. Damn. Oh, hello. <laughs> come on. Please, car. All right, we'll just go back this way. Bye. Yeah, just see if we can go old school with this. Fancy driving there. He's real smart. Oh, we might be about to lose one of the police cars. Oh, my God. My whole damn luck. Man, you're chewing up oh, for fuck's sake. Girl. There's Get always the one. You. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Did that fire truck take out the police car? Oh, I think it did. But there's still two more. For, for fuck's sake. Where are you all coming from? The police precinct. I know. <laughs> Ow. I say drive to the Can you stop getting T-boned at high speed today? Find enough of it. Like, do, do you want to fuck off? Do you want to fuck off? You're not supposed to be avoiding traffic. That's not very driver of you. Oh my god. <laughs> You're not the boss of me, Ordell. You're not the boss of me. No. That's not. That's not an open part of the city. Well, that's useful. We can't get. Why can't we get back in our car? Why can't we get back in our car? All right, we'll just get a bus. All right, get a bus, and hopefully we'll be on the scene. <laughs> right, yeah. Fuck's sake. Uh, 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 oh, oh, you're slowed up. 
Right, hopefully, the blithering numbskull that's driving our car right now will slow all the police cars down. And then we come ramming in with the arcade bus, uh, the bus arcade out of nowhere. Oh, hello. Oh, we've got a fire truck on our side as well, bitches. Fuck all of you. Fuck all of you. Oh, well, hang on. Oh, we nearly blocked them in with the bus. That would have been Tekkers. Fuck off. Damn. Oh, here we go. We're, oh, here we go. We've got some serious damage now to all of San Francisco downtown as well as the police department. Quickly, go. Right, go. We might be able to leg it here. No. No, because the top speed of this car is still three miles an hour. Fuck it. <laughs> Sorry, Herbie. Oh, God. Ow. Oh. Sorry, Herbie. Ooh, hello. Oh, for fuck's sake. Did we neutralize that police car? How? <laughs> for fuck's sake. All right, we'll sacrifice an Alfa Romeo for cause. All three police cars are still alive. Ow. Can you just die already? Can you just die? The rogue Alfa Romeo Mitos. For fuck. Fuck you. Fuck. Fuck. Hey. How many missions does this game have again? Uh, quite a lot. How many missions does this game have? A lot. How many times have we tried this mission? A lot. Damn it. That's all? Damn, Damn it, it, count five. Unless I beg, right? Block a road with a bus. You know what? Travis, Not a bad strat. We might have to do it. We might have to do it, too. We'll go down an alley first. They don't like alleyways. Wait, what the fuck? So, <laughs> for a moment, I was like, have we just lost the cop by turning down an alleyway? No, not quite. No, because this top speed of this car is three miles an hour. Because this car has a top speed of 11. Jeez. <laughs> Man, I feel alive today. Don't you feel alive? Everything feels so positive. I feel like that. Why? Because you're talking like you swallowed more. Fuck off. Wow. Getting penetrated mainly. It's like I'm cursed. Ordell believes today is your lucky day. It's not your lucky day. So they might have been your lucky day if you'd picked a better car. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> right, we're on the... Uh, just need to find something. The problem is, like, trying to... Mind-jacking other... Mind-jacking. Mind-jacking other cars to ram them into the police cars doesn't really work because your car's so slow, the police cars are just swarming around your car anyway. Man, you're chewing up our time like a little girl. Hit the gas! Quad air out demonstrandum right there. It, it's... Uh, fuck's sake. Another cheese track just keeps circling a block. You might... We might have to. We might have to employ hardcore cheese. Meantime, a beetle. Ram. Oh my god, really? You're so useless. Busting up the car ain't helping. Have you, have you really got any more bright ideas? You absolute genius. Oh, it's a fire truck. Fire truck. <gasps> Petrol truck. Petroleum tanker. How have we missed all of them? There were three police cars there, and we missed all of them. Right, yo, right. Yo! Ram! How are we already... We're nearly going to be busted. How? Oh, hang on. Can I tow one of the police cars? Tow one of the police cars. No. No. Come back. Now, where are you going? Goal! Again. I've not been getting on the score sheets very often, but, uh, you know... Come on, come on, go, go. Bam, bam, come on. Yes, yes, we've towed a police car. <laughs> we've towed a police car. Oh, now fire truck's ramming on the... Right, go. I'm shoving my car along with a fire truck. So we have now disabled one of the police cars with a tow truck. Oh, yeah. Right, okay, well, one of the other cop cars is low on health now. It's actually dead. It's actually dead. It's been... De Oi, you, come back. Oh, there's more police cars joining the chase. I didn't clock that. Right, you. 
No, you're not getting past me. You're not. <laughs> nice try, sunshine. Oh, hello. Kabang! There you go. <laughs> Just... <laughs> the more effective strat seems to be ramming our own car with the fire truck and collecting the police cars as collateral damage. Try flick handbrake to flee. I mean, what can you really do? The police cars are so close. You just, they just uh, PIT maneuver that. There's another one dead. Right, here we go. Right, we've got one car left in the pursuit. 15 seconds. Come back. Come back. Please. 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 Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck off. Yes. Go quick. Go. Run away! Damn it! Damn it! That's all. Oh, fire truck immediately! Immediate fire truck! Go, 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 go! And then, do the oh. Yes! Oh yeah! There you go! Finally, it's worked! Finally, it's worked! All right. Now see if we can pull the same trick again. Sorry, not quite. We'll take we'll take this car though. Fuck you. No to that car. And now what? We, why are you why are you trying to go up here? That was a bad strategy. That was a bad strategy called Darius, or whatever you're called. Bong. Man, I feel alive today. Don't you feel alive? Ooh, this boss. So Ooh, that's a dude. Because you're you talking like you swallowed more than a taco. And we're back up to three cars pursuing us. Oh, it's a rim truck. Rim truck. Find the cop. Always got to be there. This is just going down. It's Hello. Like we, we nearly. Oh, we nearly Maybe lost them for half a second, and then they were just like, "Oh, let's just accelerate back to the back of this car, which we can do easily." Well, this is. Yep. This is really fun. Really, a lot of fun. Yep. It's great. I, I love. I love this. Knowing you, the Elio and Simon. Hello, now. Epic Team. Who, what? What's this? Passion is moving to Maya Shank Racing. No way! Man, Holy shit! Elio Casanova and Simon Passion on the same team. I'm out here for it. Right, we're on the highway now, so we've got a bit more room to play with with oncoming car, chess, pinball, whatever. Woo, but more space to miss cars is what I meant. Right, yo. Oh my god, really? Why? Really? Why? Right, you'll do. They've turned. He, why have you taken the turning? Why is this bleathering idiot taking the turn? For fuck's sake. Take over Brooklyn 4. Take over San Fran. Right, here we go. The only good thing we've got going for us at the moment is that Darius is such a slow driver that we can just steal another car. Well, quantum leap into another car and catch up with the chase and start ramming police cars that way. Like that. Exactly like that. Oh my god, why? You're, you're so bad at this. You, you're really bad at this whole driving thing. Says me. Right, you. Please. Please. You. Fuck off. You. Fuck off. You. Nudge. <laughs> Nudge. Box standard out for a man 159. No one will miss it. Bang! There you go. There's one. <clears throat> now, where's he going? Right, he's going over there. Do, 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 do. Right, ordinary tax cabs. If that's all we have to do. If that's all we have, that's all we have to play with. Hold Fuck on, you. I know I ran my own car. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. And it did nothing. <laughs> I don't remember this mission being this difficult at all. What's this? Another one of your shortcuts Sorry. that never are. Another one of your shortcuts, no. Another one of my head-on crashes. Ruin the engines here, hello. How are you doing? I'm so sorry, sis. For what? Aren't you listening? I right, look, not right now, okay? Not... Will you forgive me? No, I'm driving hello, you head-on into a car crash. I'm going to hand you over to the police now. Say nothing if you're cool with that.
Why does... Why the fuck does our stupid Darius Dingbat over here... It's like he's literally aiming for the car that I'm in. Oh my god, we're going to get... Oh, having, that, having said that though, there's one down. We've got about 20 seconds to kill the other one. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Uh, uh, but go, you, you'll do. Right. Coming up now, coming up now, coming up now, the Funk's old brother. Shaking up now, the Funk's old brother. Uh, uh. Full of blind crest that you can't see where you go. You, you, you. Fuck you! You didn't die? I told you, my location shoot. Damn it. That's all? Damn it? Unless I beg, right? Jericho It's not seven attempts. Move seven attempts at this one stupid mission. I'm looking at five years. Stay calm, AJ. You love this game. One of your, fa one of your favorites of all time. Man, I feel alive, there is a reason why you, you love this game. Alive? Everything feels so beautiful. It ain't this fucking mission. <laughs> I've got to be missing something here. There's so something simple, right? There's got to be... Like I say, I must have done this mission before. But I tell you what, is there a way we can quit this mission? We, we can quit the mission. Okay, we'll save that mission for a bit. Clearly, we're not getting anywhere with it. So, let's try some of the other missions for a bit. Good thing about games like this, you can just bounce around and go into other missions. If you want. So, what's this flag mission over here? What's this all about? Finish the race first or second. John, I'm just being realistic. You've never raced before. Ooh. Is this some street racing, I see? John, I'm just being realistic. You've never raced before. I am please. I'm nervous enough already. Either we win the cash for your tuition, or we're on an airplane to Nagoya and And it's the family business. And jail before we're 40. You're going to college, Ayamu. We're not gonna end up like Dad and Uncle Joji. Okay, this is a this is a wholesome street race. This is not a Neve Speed plot I've heard before. Yo, man, get the fuck off my turf. We're racing pink slips. No, I'm racing to find my brother through college. Oh, that's actually quite wholesome. Here but still, nothing. fuck you. I am I'm <laughs> you imagine that at the end of a Neve Speed game, you defeat you really like the head boss, and it's like, I fuck you. I was statue. actually, I was actually fuck street fuck. racing to fund my own health care. Because we live in America. I can't fund my own health care. I had to street race to pay for my cancer treatment. <laughs> so far, Fucking so Breaking good. Bad so Neep Speed Edition. Alright, so we've got to win the street race in Audi TT. We're up against a bunch of Nissan uh, 370Zs. Aziz and sorry. We're winning! I'm hurt that you ever <laughs> doubted me. Breaking Bad. <laughs> very good, Oriel, very good. Now, we can use the same sort of body swapping strats as the uh, any other mission. We can if we want, but ass. I think for this one, we'll just focus on driving. We're doing all right without the need for inter <laughs> hijacking other cars to help us win. Well, we were. We are. Oh, we're still leading. Okay. It's like you're possessed. <laughs> in a good way, right? <laughs> it's like you're possessed, but, but in a good way. But the, is there a good way of being possessed that's not creepy? You, you raise a good question. <laughs> you raise a good dilemma there. We're at first, high five. Hey, I'm driving and I don't do that. <laughs> I don't like high fives and I don't like milky tea. <laughs> All right, here we go. And then you yeah, cross the line. Yes. What did I say? Not a problem. You have to go to. You're going to college, mate. Study, uh, apply to your free. I don't know. Kamara mission is very dependent on the car you're given. The car I'm given shit, so. <laughs> right, okay. So we've actually done a. So Ooh, hello. We've unlocked a new brain power. <laughs> Gee, this is getting like those sci fi films where it's like. Like, I remember there was one a few years ago. I think it was called Amy or something. Um. And it just had Morgan Freeman trying to explain this theory. It was just him in like a college lecture hall, like, humans only use 10% of our brains to function. If we could use 20% or 30% or even 100%, some really crazy shit could happen. 
So uh, yeah, that was like their one of their storylines to. Um... Oh, hang on a minute. This isn't moving around the city. So I can affect a car in different ways. Right. How about more speed? Here we go. Okay. So now, driving along, John Tanner now has his own Norse tanks. Whoa, speed. Hell. And then. Let's give that another speed. Go. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> Who needs nitrous? Who needs nitrous when you are the NOS tank? Well, I'll be honest, I think this might make the Camaro mission a bit easier. So uh, maybe I'll start doing other missions first. Again, another nice thing about these games, you can play other missions, unlock shit, that you're only getting five MP. Shut up, Mike. <laughs> Mike, shut up. I'm still having fun with it. Anyway, what's this? Uh... <gasps> yes! Nice driving, Craig. Five months worth of lessons, you're finally getting the hang of this now. Really? No! We tried the carrot, we diced and sautéed it, and fed it to the dog. Now it's time for the stick. You're gonna learn to drive if it kills you. But I... I... Okay, so, uh... We've got a very nervous 17-year-old here who's really struggling with the concept of driving. Appreciate that? I was very anxious before a lot of my driving lessons, especially before my driving test. However, I had a good driving instructor. Clearly, this lad's got a very shit driving instructor. And I believe he deserves to be punished for his hubris. I think Tanner agrees with us. Here's the perfect example of fucking around with this mechanic. All right, where we go. You know what, pal? You're really pissing me off. That's nice, Craig. We'll find you a clean pair of pants back at the office. Oh, that does it. We'll see who needs new pants. <laughs> All of a sudden, this nerdy 17-year-old is just like driving God. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm billing your parents for this, Craig. Oh yeah? Send the check to I Don't Exist. 101 Fakesville Avenue. Craig. Let's just slow down and whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, what was that? Slow down. Did you say slow down? I'm using my turn signal. I don't know what you're talking about, mate. Great stuff. Good lesson. Now, uh, pull over on the right here, please, Craig. Oh, uh, there's still time on the clock. I want my I'll tell you what as well, learning to drive in a Fiat Arbor in a Fiat 500 Arbor, that's a pretty well, spicy car to be learning to drive in. I have my dick in you have your dick. Do? <laughs> <laughs> Please, I'm too young. <laughs> ah, there you go. That was easy, wasn't it? <laughs> Clean pants, that's what you need. <laughs> so there you go. Right then, driving instructor, go suck your mom. And uh, 9 11, I would like to report an incident of dangerous driving. You can boost it. Oh shit, yeah. Okay, we well, didn't need to. So we got a couple more missions, and the next, the next story mission is unlocked. That's there's a T on the map. But you know what? The side missions are really fun. So let's go and uh, I love sassy Tan. He's very sassy in this game. Right, we're not going to do that again. We're not going to try that again yet. Let's see over here. What this is. Breaking news. Film stunts for the TV show. All right. GMC Savannah. Right. Okay. Hey, what about the old lady with a flat tire? Gold. Jack, the show's called World's Craziest Drivers. We put the car in carnage. See what they did there. Have you ever watched the show? I read books. Drink fine wine. You keep bringing me grandma with a flat. You're going to be reading one ad. Now go get me something with some action. All right. Tanner's fantasy coma world is full of sports cars. Yeah, it really is. All right. So uh, get to the filming location. Get to the chopper. We got no filming permit for this street, Marie. Let's get to the agreed location. Yeah, yeah. Ready to put the car in carnage? Do you know something I don't? Just keep your camera rolling, Jeff. It's Jack. <laughs> and this better be good. <laughs> yeah, all right. Whatever, Jeff. The name's Jack. Listen, shut up, Jeff. <laughs> Listen, Jeff, shut up. All right, so we park it up here. Here we go. Speeding cars are where it's at, so keep your eyes peeled. Film each stunt in the blue zone. Well, shut up, Jeff. <laughs> Literally. Well, here's the thing, right? We could wait for someone to just randomly drive past driving all wacky, or we could do it for them. So uh, let's just raid this Lincoln Town car. 
Do 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 drive over 100 miles an hour. Can this car even do 100 miles an hour? It's time to find out. Uh, it may not be able to. It may not be able to. Come on. Come on. Yep. Yeah. Uh, nearly. Not quite. Okay. Hang on. Yeah. Right, hang on. All right, let's see if we can do it this way. Booster, of course, yeah, I forget I've got that. All right, here we go. And... Speed. There we go. Not quite Bonneville <laughs> Flats, but good enough for... Just some nutter in a Lincoln you Town Call. Like, <laughs> Come on, give me some time. Lights, camera, and some drifting action. Did man say drifting? Did man's just say drifting? Oh, yeah, we were talking about that, that uh, Oldsmobile wagon earlier. Here it is. <laughs> here it is. All right, here we go. Right. And then... Yeah! Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. The drift wagon. Drifting's cool, but I want to see cars colliding. Head oh, on. you want to see a massive crash, do you? Just a little head-on collision. Have a head-on crash. Off, just enough to I think I can do that. <laughs> Everyone watching the Camaro mission, uh, we saw repeatedly that you could. You tried having head-on crashes a lot there. Uh, you, you didn't. All right, so... Uh, oh, this guy's coming. Right. In the zone. Smash. <laughs> another Bonk. day, another airbag. <laughs> oh, yeah. And uh, shift back into the news van. There you go. What do you think? I love it, but I want Oh, more. he's getting greedy. You he's getting so. greedy. Your eyes on the city. Karen, uh, Karen's, ergonom <laughs> Karen's ergonomic orange cum cumquat. Karen's er ergonomic orange kumquat. Your eyes on the city. You want an Emmy? Got a bag of some pink. Film a jump with cops chasing. Just the place. All right, who wants to jump their way into the big time? Shift into a civilian vehicle. Well, presumably one that can actually go fast enough to make a jump. To do a sick, uh, do a sick ramp jump. No, I don't want wagons now. I don't want, uh, I don't want Terry Wogan now. I'm gonna store this and replay it again. God damn it! Hey. One down. Right, there's a charger. There was a four GT that just went past, back up here. Whether it's still there or whether it's despawned, I don't know. Where, where's our, where the bloody hell's our car? We just lost. <laughs> Hang on. Triangle. You know we. Could... Um. 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 The wagon has like four hundred horsepower. <laughs> well. My G. Now, and now typically I can't find one. I was just about to be like, all right, just for you, Mike, I'm going to do this sick ramp jump in a wagon. But now they've all stopped spawning. They're all like, fine, you don't want a wagon anymore. There we go. Right. I'm going to give Jeff some TV gold. All I got to do is play Pied Tag a cop, you say. And make him jump well, yeah, you can do this to start off a chase. Oh, no, I'm just going to nudge a cop. On, right, where we go? Who wants their five minutes of fame? Uh, we're going the wrong way for a start, so... Bye! Out <laughs> the way! Booster! Oh, look at that! <coughs> oh, shit! Oh, the cops join the chase! Ow, 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 ow! Right. Gow! No, we're supposed to be going down here now! You're not... Ow! I've been aimly penetrated! Why do police cars always come in threes? Why do they always come in threes? Right, anyway, here we go. Right, we're going down here. Here we go. Here we go. Booster. <laughs> nice. There we go. And I smell awards. Best early evening low budget people are stupid show. We deserve it, Jeff. We do, and my name is Jack. Whatever, Jeff. <laughs> Shut up, Jeff. <clears throat> yeah, there we go. That was fun. So, uh, oh, hang on. There's a few... Ah, there's some movie markers on here. While we're here, see if we can find a, a fast car to do a nice sick jump. Pick up some movie tokens. You know what? This will do. <laughs> I bet this thing goes. Her name's Chassie, okay? You give her one scratch and I will whoop your ass. Oh, no, no, I'm, I won't scratch her. I don't know what you're talking about. Jeff. <laughs> oh, I think you go the same route that we just did for that ramp jump. 
and uh, you pick up that film token. The movie token, I should say. Just like the movies. Or however that Alien Ant Farm song goes. The only other Alien Ant Farm song anyone knows. Other than a song that isn't even theirs. But it's very good. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Good. There we go. Oh my God. I didn't scratch it, okay? Bye. <laughs> All of a sudden, it's just like, shoo! <laughs> All of a sudden, not my problem. Okay. Well, the, what other stuff have we got on the map to do? Ooh. We've got this. Relay race. Three and one win the relay race. Okie doke. All right, let's do this. <clears throat> like I say, it's the sort of game where you can fuck around doing side activities forever. Okay. Pure driving, no shifting. Get on the leaderboards. Improve your rank by replaying. And we're in a rather nice Alfa Romeo. This is a TZ22. Win the relay race. Now, I thought that that meant switch cars at certain. It might still be. Okay. Oh, we do still have boost, though, do we? We do have boost. Boost. Uh, there we go. Oh, that's some driver strats right there. Alpha Julia TZ2. There we go. Okay, so... Not seeing the relay part of the relay race yet, but... target is five minutes so either that's grossly overestimated or there is more to this than uh, just these 15 checkpoints oh that was a viper acr back there nice there's so many cars in this game i keep forgetting what cars are even in this game oh, the movie token back there love this alpha i mean shit who doesn't who doesn't you know the whole top gear thing of like you're not a true petrohead unless you've driven you fuck off you get out of my way um you're on my side of the road, shut up. Um, yeah, you know, they always say, like, you're not being a true Petrohead unless you're driven an Alfa Romeo. This is the Alfa Romeo people have in mind. Because, spoiler alert, it's not a Maito. Oh, there we go. Okay, so, as soon as we come through the final checkpoint, we've now jumped into another car. And so is everyone else. We're now fucking driving lorries. Doikman lorries. Woohoohoo! Three through lorries. Out the way, sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> Speed smash. <laughs> oh, sorry, that was a Chevelle. Very sorry. Big rigs. Big rigs, but it's better. Yeah, this is big rigs over the road racing HD remaster. <laughs> you never knew it. Now, there's the HD remaster we really need. You know, forget GTA 5. Uh, forget GTA 5. Now we're releasing it on the latest brand of toaster. To, to join the billion other platforms it's already been ported to and remastered for, including the graphic calculator, microwave oven, uh, smart fridge, um, I don't know, uh, Apple Watch. <laughs> it's been remastered for the Apple Watch. We need big rigs over the road racing HD remaster. Get flipping Vicarious Visions on it, the guys who did the Crash Bandicoot and Tony Hawk's remasters, to do that. Big rigs remastered. Oh yeah, the boldius. Apparently we're a, we're a better truck driver than we are a car driver because we're leading by miles. Oh, oh. This is a drifty lorry. This is like that episode of um, it's like the Top Gear Challenge where they all buy second-hand lorries, and they 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 it's it's Stig's truck driving cousin. It's Rig Stig. Oh, now we're in our UFRT12. You know, a, a not 911, because this was still in the dark ages where Porsche was chained up in EA's basement. Every time it was like, please, please let me go and play in another game now, please. You're doing nothing but put me in Real Racing 3 in another shit Need for Speed game, please. EA's just like, nope, here's the contract. Here's the contract you signed 25 years ago. Or rather, your vicious stepdad signed 25 years ago. So we're going to go fucking fucking Joseph Fritzl on this license have you chained up in the dungeon for 20 years Forza Motorsport finally was like here Porsche here it's okay we're gonna rescue you we're gonna rescue you from the dungeon and put you in another racing game 
you could finish the checkpoints by going faster at maximum in reverse. Well, yeah. Well, it's got to be accurate, you know. That could be a thing, you know. If they remaster a famously broken game, have it in, like, fixed mode, but also original mode, where all the bugs are still in it. So if you did a remaster Big Rigs, uh, you'd be like, I want to play the game as it actually is working, or I just want to play it in original mode with all the original bugs. I'm not saying RUF don't, don't, don't deserve respect on their name. Thanks to EA, we know about Ruff, or Roof, and also Gimbella. So nice, completely that, mate. I'm just going to grab my nasal spray. <clears throat> Got penguin biscuit. So, let's monitor this biscuit and decide what we're doing next. Mm. Have a look around, shall we? Oh, something over here. I think I know what this is. We're going to leave it for the moment. Will you try the Camaro mission? You know what? Stay above 50 mile an hour in oncoming for 20 seconds. All right, we'll do this there. It's coming up. It's coming up. It's there. Oh. All right, so we need a decent long bit of straight road. In a tiring day, Mark. No pressure. Do what you need to do. Go get yourself some rest. Have a snooze. Thank you for being here as usual. Oh, there's a movie token over here. Oh, it's only 50 miles an hour in oncoming, isn't it? Okay, so... Right. That looks like a fairly decent straight road. Let's go! Right, where we go? Let's do this properly and only stay just above 50 miles an hour. We're following the Jackie Stewart Maxim. Win a race while going as slowly as possible. It's possible. And there you go. EZ. Right. Now that that's happened. Oh, hello. It's very much a magpie game. Ooh, shiny. Ooh, shiny. Adrenaline activity. Uh, let's go back to our garage. Let's go back to our garage area. See if any upgrades. Oh, upgrades have unlocked. Okay. Ability bar size. Nice. Mm hmm. Open mm hmm. Income only buy. Nice. What thrill, Kim? I don't think got a steering wheel when you play with the controller. Well, it's kind of a controller only game. Also, hello, Sneaky Perry. How are you doing? Are you new in here? Lovely to see you. Um, ability bar size. We'll do that. It's not real. Despite being called Driver, it's not a wheel-friendly game. We chance speed. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. So, there we go. All right. Challenges. Oh, yeah, I, I, I own those from uh, previous runs through the game, I think. I think I'm, I think I'm new here. <laughs> oh, lovely to see you in here. Hope you, hope you enjoy your stay here. <laughs> Enlarged ability bottle. Sounds like some of the spam emails I get. All right. We give this Kamara mission another go. I think it's time. I think it's time. Darius, we can't leave the cops to this. No, we can't. And this time we're not gonna. <coughs> here we go. Car, and here we go. I'm looking at five years. 
that'd be a real tragedy. Did someone say something about just sticking on an open highway. Oh, that longer boosted. Oh my god. We're on the verge of nearly losing the cops already just by using the boost. God damn it, Darius. Oh shit, there's no. There's no there's shit. Don't you feel alive? Everything feels so Speed! Oh, this Camaro has some speed now, thanks to my mind powers. It's, it's still not working, though. It's, it's still not working. You really don't have anything useful to contribute, do you? There you go. Nope. Well, the strat of going wrong way down a highway road. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to do that game. I don't know if you've noticed. We're obviously there, have. We gotta get these <laughs> there, D. There we go. Oh, yeah. Man, you're chewing up our time driving like a little Ubisoft. Girl. Yeah, they did. I wish this game was alive. It's live. Thankfully, it's alive for me because I have two box copies. Oh, well, come on. Oh, come on. We're going to do it. Oh, All man, right. lads. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, clearly, we found out the reason why this game, this mission really wasn't much of a challenge the first time I played it because I didn't do it. First try, yeah. Gee, it's almost like having massive speed boost is really helpful for a slow as shit car. I love the fact the police cars in general have just forgotten. They've just vanished. I like, abolished this. I'm off back to the precinct. Do you want some donuts, Dave? All right. Another movie token. Nice. Dooby dooby doo doo. See, there's a few of the attempts earlier we would have been screwed on anyway because we literally, like, were coming down to the wire and we still, like, even if we had destroyed a cop car, we wouldn't have got to the meet in time. Laughed. Why they need to let me drive. I told we're gonna miss the meat, man. We're literally at the meat. Do you want me to slap you so hard? Trying to work his way up Jericho's organization? I can't let this opportunity slip by. I'm gonna have to help him any way I can. Uh huh, you see? Little extra storyline thing. You can jump into the bodies of people involved with Jericho to be like, I wonder what he's doing for them. Ordell Williams and Darius Spencer. Ordell and Darius. Fry. Oh, wait a minute. It was Ordell the guy we were controlling, or...? Worth keeping my eye on. So, they are tangentially, potentially linked to Jericho, and they might lead us somewhere. So, we'll see. <gasps> and now we've unlocked Ram! Just pick a car, John. Yeah, pick a car. Any car. Let it all go. Boom! Oh, wham, bam, oh. thank you, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> no harm in a little more practice. Okay. Well, if you say so. Kabam! Oh, oh God. I'm just murdering the instance. Ordell's the nagging. All oh, right, Darius is the guy we were controlling then. And then, boom! <laughs> it's like that Sliver song. Click, click, boom! You unlock the yeah. fuck you ability. Really problem. did. Oh, yeah, Roy. Yeah, Roy. Chase activity unlocked. Oh, you mean something we can use that RAM ability in? Is that what you're saying? This is what Big Rig's HD remaster really needs. I agree. Is that a movie token or a... Ah, 30 meter jump. Okay. What about this over here? Form stunts. Cunning stunts. What about this over here? Avoid the cops and make a daring escape. Alright, here we go. Yeah, let's do it. Even before, you can't use your brain abilities now. Oh, god damn it. We're in an Aston Martin DB5. James, I don't know. All right, so we can use all our speed abilities, our mind powers. Ow! Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, God. I think this is supposed to be a kind of simulation of one of those old driver standards. Survival mode. Ow. 
Ow. Ow. I'm being... I'm being... Ow. The seven. Oh, my God. The seven of them now. Yeah, I think this is a spoof survival mode run. So, in which case... In which... Can, can we not shift? I want to shift. Oh, my God. We can't shift. No. All right. Fuck this. We out of here. In which case, we out. No! <laughs> drives like a spoon. Ow! Fuck off! This is like some final boss police chase. It needs to be carbon. Uh, yeah. Burger! That was, believe it or not, a DeLorean that we just annihilated by accident there. Look, it was completely by accident. I didn't do anything. I didn't choose this life. Really did. Really didn't. Because if I did, I'd chose the better getaway car. No, no disrespect. Ow! <clears throat> I'll come cleanly. It's a fair cop. <laughs> it's a fair cop. Um, <laughs> don't focus on losing the cops. Focus on getting across the bridge. Well, both of those things seem pretty difficult. If I'm honest, <laughs> if I'm honest. Oh, a clip. Thank you, Mike. Um, do you know what? Let's stop beating about the bush. Shall we go and do the story mission? I think we should. Try and look some more cool shit to do. Because really, the story missions—they're just boring. I'm gonna do those. I'm joking. They're not. Prove to Jones you can shit. I mean, shift. All right. Let's grab a cup of coffee. There's something I need to talk to you about. You're not pregnant again, are you? Uh, Honestly, no, I'm gay. This thing I got going on, it makes about as much sense. <laughs> it's being pregnant. All right. First time it happened. I was like floating above it. Mm-hmm. Your standard near-death experience, huh? Yes. Yeah, right. <laughs> yes. The next time it happened... Could sort of pick a body and wham, I, I, I'm inside them. <laughs> Just look at like, the like, fuck is, the like fuck I'm, is this I'm guy? How much crack has this guy been and I on? I see this strange chick looking back at me, and I realize I'm in the body of a girl. Man, finish your damn donut, then I'm taking you to a shrink. I'm serious. This is real. This is real. I'm really doing LSD. I'm really doing acid. Prove it. But if I'm less than 100% convinced, I'm checking you All right. In. Bet. <laughs> All right, Done. bet. Let's go. How how do you prove this? Oh, man. Check out that jackass. This is basically Lightning McQueen and Mato. It really is. You know what? You want proof? Let me do something crazy with that guy, and you'll get your proof. Shift now, into the jackass. jackass go? Bro, just tell her you were with me. Jump off a car. Oh, much. shit, like that one. Hang on. Place. Wait a minute. Never find out. Never find out what? Yeah, oh, for fuck. Right, for fuck's No. No. <laughs> I didn't make it rammed. Oh, Why it looks. Use your damn eyes. Yep, hang on. Stick with me here, Jones. Hang on. Right. This one. Here we go. And you. Oh yeah. <laughs> Check that out, Jones. Who? Jones. It's my. Uh, <laughs> no, hang on. We need to go back. <laughs> hang on. There we go. <laughs> oh crap, man! That guy's a complete maniac. Uh uh. I'm the complete maniac. Don't play me, man. You got a tip off, right? What's he pumping? PCP. <laughs> into injected Look, into my veins. What if he pisses off the cops? He's already pissing me off. I mean other cops. Watch. All right, so we jump back in the jackass, into Watch the jackass. I'm telling you, you just Tag and jumped car. Right, okay. the car over a truck. Key vehicles I marked did. on minimap. Yep, all right. Well, there's we one up here. Like Yo, Jones, in. you watch him. What? Jones fam, you watch no. him. Watch this. All right, out the way. All right, you. <laughs> it 
was the responsible thing to do. You're bringing the whole priest. <laughs> You're right. What was I thinking? Ow. Hold tight. I'm gonna do anything I can to put things right. Dude, who's the cops? Okay. In a Pontiac Solstice. <laughs> Do you know what? I've just, ow, just had a, I've just had a funny feeling. You know what I'm thinking? A modern Neve Speed game, like a Neve like Speed Carbon like remaster, hey with this physics and for fuck's sake. Just pull over so I can break your neck. Well, that's not very nice. Well, that's just not very nice, is it? Now, for fuck's sake, cool. if I stop. Try that again? We stop doing no, this. I'm so or... close to losing the police no, every no, time. No, no, no. Sleep. Sleep. Why does this that? keep that happening? You want to go again? For fuck's sake! No, no I'm, no, I'm good. good. You know what, homie? I'm good. <laughs> Bro, I really don't like this. Oh, do you know? What? Oh, that's a shame. Tough shit. Oh. Oh, for God's sake. I'm getting war flashbacks. Out of the way! Why is there traffic in this massive built-up city? Oh, God. Right. And then... Shit! Shit! <laughs> Please. I'll be honest, I'm kind of fed up with trying to get so, away from police uh, in cars that can't do that. <laughs> that just can't do that. Ten, nine, Steady, eight. So, why? Yes. Why is yes. this for We're fuck's sake? Them. We would have been free there. We might still be. We might still be. No, no, stop. No, no, please, no. I think we're getting go, away. Go, go. We're so close. So close to freedom. Yes. Yeah, and I bet they won't be able to trace us, like with the plate, the make, the color, all that stuff. <laughs> God damn it. Anyway, bye. You see that? I did that. Me, not him. Me. What? John, my mama could have told you that fool was going to track some key. Give it up, man. <laughs> Right. 50 bucks says he's hooked to a tow truck before they catch him. Whatever, man. It's your money. <laughs> Whatever, man. Uh, fam, it's your money. Right. Oh, hello. There's a tow truck right there. Madness. What's got into you? Trust me. I think you we need to... Believe me I think we I need to get our car towed. We've just not paid enough parking fines this year. Bonk. <laughs> this is Pontiac's last car before going... But was it? Wait a couple minutes, then punch me in the face as hard as you can. <laughs> Jones is now a believer. Whoa! whoa th there's no part of me that wants to believe what I just saw. Yeah, but you saw it. I'm not losing my mind. It's real. Yeah, it, it looks that way. <laughs> Man. So, let me get this straight. Will you step into a fine looking lady? I keep my hands on the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jones, right. Jones, chill. <laughs> Y'all, Jones, chill. Jones is like, Shit, I guess you're telling the truth. Previously, Oh, is there a way we could make this horny? No, Tony, shut up. Oh, by the way, previously, previously on Triver. Jericho put a bullet in my head. Not a man in the ground. Yeah, no, we're, we're fine. We don't need to. We've literally, we've literally just played all that. Okay, kidnapped, unlocked. Okay, so. Challenge Tanner's day off. Tear through Russian Hill in Tanner's iconic Dodge Challenger. All right. I will. I love this TV series. Like, intro. Oh, it's great. Just we don't need to watch it right now. <laughs> Previously on a game we've already been playing just now. Oh, shit. Shit. All right, where we go? Complete the checkpoint route. I will. And we got boost doing everything, so that's good. So what you're saying is we just do a checkpoint run in John's in John Tanner's Dodge Challenger, one of my favourite cars of all time. So we're just gonna vibe in his Challenger, is what you're saying. I'm, you know, I couldn't be more. Oops. 
Oops, there we go. Uh, right, okay, you know, just a little diversion there. Just uh, doing a cautionary sweep of the immediate environment. He's still a police officer, he has to, he has to do his due diligence, you know? He has to scope the area out. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, pardon me. Oh, I think I vaguely remember the route of this one. Would you stop that? Can people just stop existing? What you need for the next episode is some YouTube-friendly 70s funk tunes. <laughs> just, funk, just go for funky cops on this. Uh, you know what? I'm not opposed to it. Bonk. The only good cop in San Francisco. See you so. Oh, this time, we know to turn right. <laughs> right. Target three minutes, and we're at one minute 48 with five checkpoints to go, so it should be all right. I think it's just basically two laps of this route. We would have done a lot better if we actually knew where we were going on the first lap, but, you know, needs must. We move. I love how impactful everything is as well. Like, even just, a, like, ramping down a road. It's just like... Poof, it's like, bang, like that. It feels, like, epic. Which it should, you know? Here we go. Oh, oh, I thought we could call handbrake turn around the front of that charger. Obviously, we couldn't. But never mind, we'll still beat it. There we go. 20 Gs. It's realistic. It is. It is. Except without the collapsed suspension and, you know, destroyed car. Uh, <clears throat> oh, but there's not really much else in terms of side activity. To, well, there's some of these, like, challenges and dares and stuff like that to do. What's this one? Use the cops and get to the destination. Unlocks the Ford Ground Victoria to buy. Not bad. What about this? Jump 150 meters in 45 seconds. All right, I will. This physics would be perfect for an Alarm for Cobra 11 game. What is Alarm for Cobra 11? I, I will be honest, I, I don't really know what that is. So, right, jump 150 meters in 45 seconds. So what if we go down here Okay, so the timer is on. Oh, it's combined! Oh, it's not all at once! Okay, hang on. Well, even better then. Alright. Yeah, and then going down here, hopefully. Yep, and then yep, and then yep, yep, yep. And then yep, and then yep. And then, ooh, steady. Alright, we need to do another run through that quick. All right, go, 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 go. Yes, there you go. Nice. Whee! Whee! <laughs> Very nice. Let me recap quickly. German TV show about an autobahn patrol. Okay, I can vibe with that. Main pro tags are a body cop pair that drive you for a BMW 3 Series or Mercedes C-Class undercover car. I can vibe with that, for sure. Definitely vibe with that. Um, yeah, do you know what? I think we'll just keep going with the story mission for the, mo ow, for the moment until we, uh, yeah, we get some. Oh, hello. But meantime, let's just nick us. Change of plan. What do you think you're doing, honey? Hoomst. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Just gonna cruise around in the Cadillac for a bit. A proper caddy. Do I instigate a police chase in this car? No, I don't think so. Oh, hang on. I know what we can do. So, what oh, is it damn we're it. supposed to do? Yeah, you're asking the wrong guy. I was gonna, I was gonna try and tow that police car. Still might be able to. Right, yo, yo. Was that intentional or an accident? Oh god, <laughs> we've entered into a cop chase. Right, this is slightly backfired, but. 
still. What happens when they catch us? <laughs> <Don't worry. They don't. laughs> there you go. We out of here. In fact, this, this may have backfired slightly because I think we now need to get away in that car specifically, which is <laughs> which is towing police cars. So what do we do today? Now. <laughs> Me too, kid. We, we can use that ramming, that whole ramming thing. Oh, why are we not driving that Viper SRT? Never mind. I can't even bring myself to crash it. Oh! <laughs> yeah, because the ram ability also, when you're charging up, it sort of goes into bullet time. Easy to aim like that. Oh, yeah. There you go. There you go. Right. And there's no time limit in this one? No, there isn't by the look of it. All right, here we go. And then... <laughs> and then <laughs> oh this is brilliant mind powers are just the best thing right we've got another Ford F-150 here so here come the police whoop, whoop, that's the sound of the police oh. wasn't even aiming at that car it just showed up on the scene hey guys sorry I'm late oh so, hey guys sorry I'm late oh fuck <laughs> Oh, <laughs> was that enough to kill? <laughs> I think that was enough to kill that car. Just me booping it lightly. Oh, just missed. A kid slamming Hot Wheels cars into each other. You know what? You, you're really not. Oh, this one Cadillac. This one caddy. Is ru this one caddy boy is ruining everything. Smash. Ah, uh, it's just the sooner you get the chase done, the more willpower you win from it. We get a ticket. Ow. Uh, I've got some bad news. Oh, he escaped. <laughs> I've never had a... You've never had a what? Never had a dream come true till the day that I found you. Yeah, I'm a Zescot 7 fan as well, it. mate, but not right now. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. This is brilliant. <laughs> Stuck to the toe truck again. <laughs> right, well, that's annihilated the Cadillac that was behind the other one. Right, so what the fuck? That one's just floating in space. We don't ask. Who? Oh, for fuck's sake. Another one conveniently showed up right on the set. DJ Khaled is spawning these police cars right now. Oh, not if we can help it. <laughs> DJ Khaled is spawning these police cars. Oh, for fuck's sake, there's another one coming. Right, if you want to keep lining them up then, I'll keep knocking them down. You know, would you, why would you do that? Smash, there we go. Go, 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 go. So, what is it we're supposed to do? Yeah, you're asking the wrong guy. <laughs> I, I, I don't know, fam. Fam, I don't know. Ooh, a nice big fire truck. <laughs> Smash! Oh. Yes! Yes! <laughs> the tow truck just picks up police cars waiting for me to show up. Oh, God, why? Right, I've literally got God powers and you're still failing this. How... How bad are you? Pow! There we go. Boom, boom, pow. Oh, yeah. Pow. Come on, John. You know, I'm, I'm do doing as best I can here. I'm a fire truck. A Wogan. Fuck it, let's go for the Wogan. Boom! <laughs> oh, this is therapeutic, you know. This is very pleasant. Right, you... Bang! <laughs> fire truck, fire truck, fire truck, fire truck, fire truck! Fire truck! Bollocks! <laughs> fire bollocks! <laughs> who's the cops? Who's the cops? Who's the cops? Bollocks! Why do I keep missing? I'm not very clutch in uh, clutch situations. Bollocks! Oh, I think my shift powers only recharge when I'm in a car, so... Yeah, here we go. Yeah, okay, right. In which case... We just glazed him a glancing blow. All right, you'll do. Boom! <laughs> oh, yeah. Click, click, boom, indeed. Boom! There you go. Lose the cops, and we'll jump back in this car. So, what do we do today? I'm pretty new Six, at this. Six, five, <laughs> too, kid. four, three, two, one... What was the point of all that? There you go. Yeah, it's better if you don't it's, know. It's better if you don't know, to be honest. <laughs> oh, okay. 
All right, let's head over here and uh, do some more tea missions. <laughs> do some more tea missions. This is dispatch. We have a two zero seven in progress. Two zero seven. A kidnapping. Hell, today just got interesting. Victims one, Sarah Allen. She managed to call us on her cell from the trunk of the kidnapper's vehicle. We're on it. Patch her through. All right. We've got a kidnapped woman's rescue. She's been kidnapped in the trunk of a Perzo 207, I think. That's the most I got out of that. This is Sarah Allen. I hear you, Sarah. You at City Hall? I was by the plaza when they grabbed me. Public place. They got balls. <laughs> Hang in there, Sarah. We're on our Hang way. Hang on. We're on our way. We'll get... We'll get there in a minute. Yo! I can't help it. I'm driving. Have you seen what we're driving here, sir? One does not simply choose not to showboat in this kit. Cut. Cut. Ow. The sounds changed. Like going through a short tunnel? Or an underpass. We're coming, sir. I wouldn't, I wouldn't word it like that, Jones. Are you still horny? Chat, do we need to bonk Jones with the horny truncheon? Okay, Sarah, where are you now? I heard a bunch of police sirens. I don't... Not that there's nothing to be called in. Maybe ambulance sirens. City hospital. Okay. Good call. Would you? Can you still hear me? I just... Hello? Sarah? God damn it. What now? Right, we're here anyway. Gotta put myself in her place. What are you, Jones? I'm trying to focus. Now, we need to focus on the lady in the dance hall. I am. I am. God damn it. <laughs> Beer. Deep powers. Son of a bitch, I'm in. I gotta pop the truck. Bonk. Oh, hello. <laughs> Meantime, back over here. By the Embarcadero. Go. What? I was there in the trunk. I busted it open. Give me a heads up when you're doing that. I want to know if you're Tanner or some zombie autopilot. <laughs> Sorry. Freaking zombie. Oh shit, the bed. <laughs> Didn't realize the timer was on, we were on such a short timer. Let's go. Let's go. And yeah, we'll get that. Well, come on then, Captain Fantastic. Where is she? <laughs> Doom. She's just sat like motion sick in the back of the boot. Like, oh, blimey. Also leads to the theory like, why is downtown. no one else in the city? Like, um, right. there's clearly a car driving along with the trunk open and there's a body in the back of it. Oh, steady. Come on. Come on. Are you trying to trash this ride? No. Sure. Just... I'm running an insurance scam on the side. <laughs> Come on, Sarah. What was this someone was saying about Sassy, uh, 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 Sassy Tanner? Nay's here! Hello, Nay, how are you doing? Love to see you in here. We're playing Driver San Francisco, a game that I know you know very well. I mean, fuck it, we did a joint Let's Play of this on our old YouTube channel. It's a game we have, me and Nay have very uh, diverse uh, interest, uh, gaming interests. This is one that's in both of our top fives. Maybe the only one. That guy looks suspicious to you. The one driving away at high speed? Yes, he does. Well, we ain't gonna get the girl out in one piece if we ram the back of the vehicle. Well, what if someone from the front uh, rammed it? Yeah, that's exactly what the game wants us to do. Ooh, such as this large bus. Uh... And then... Kabonk! Oh, my God. Yeah, do it again! We've not destroyed that car, believe it or not. I love the thought of, we can't ram the back, because, you know, there's a person in the trunk. Obviously, that's fair logic. But we can ram them from the front, and what? Presumably... Oh, they're... <laughs> well done. Why, thank you. Great to see everyone here. In, the, in it, right? Not a soul noticed it. Yeah, right? I love the fact we, did, we smashed into that car head on. She didn't go... Doing! Ah! I think we rescued Sarah Allen. <laughs> Bonk. 
<laughs> oh, now the trunk's closed. Ma'am. Hello. Are you okay? Oh, Skelly's you? just subscribed. Thank We're you. Very lovely, Skelly. Board. Thank you. You don't even want to know. He always gets to be the hero. <laughs> Have you been injured in an accident at work or in the trunk of a car? <laughs> Can you tell us any more about what happened? There was this woman. She was striking. It sounded foreign, maybe Middle Eastern. She held a knife to my back and then some goon threw me in the trunk. Was she in the car too? No. She went off separately. I got a glimpse of her car. Some kind of white sports car, really expensive looking. So, there's big money involved. But why you? What line of work are you in? I'm an industrial chemist. What you reckon, Jack? Drugs? Could be. But there's something that doesn't smell right about this. Yeah, the drugs. <laughs> the drugs don't smell right. <laughs> are we talking low-grade weed? No. An industrial, an industrial chemist? Why is that ringing alarm bells? Oh, I don't know. But we've got a partial description on the kidnapper and her vehicle. Could lead to so an exotic sounding woman with a white sports car. I I'll be honest, Tanner, it's not really narrowing it down, but it is something. It's the chemicals. It's the chemical brothers. Uh, We're unlocking another part of the map now. Don't smell the chemicals. The hey, there we go. Now that Tanner in his coma is using 30% of his brain rather than 10%, he is able to access a new region of San Francisco. <laughs> that was the worst Morgan Freeman impression you've ever heard. Yep, Golden Gate Bridge, there it is. Tanner's looking moody. So, uh, Are they out on a date or? Uh, she shook up a also, I love Tanner's coat, a uh, jacket in this game. That's a ball. Car. And all that was just chapter one, right? Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> let's get all right, out of here. Let's move. Let's move. Right. Let's, let's head out from this romantic spot by the water. I love it when you can zoom out loads. You know, right? Just two fellas having a cruise. In a classic muscle car. Oh, yeah. I get the feeling some funny shit's about to happen. No? Okay. For once, I can't see just Andy with them cruising along. They sold that jacket, did they? There's got to be. Ooh, rapid shift. Yes. What was someone saying about? Um... Moving up in the world. Yes. Oh, there we go. Right. Get bang. Faster. And then okay, bang. There you go. Oh, now this. Is <laughs> uh -huh. Sadly, not to me. I <laughs> know, right? Rapid shift between partners. Oh God. Oh, there we go. And then. Oh, it's, it's like live tank team. It's like a live tag team mechanic. Come on. And then... Bang. Nudge. Nudge. And then... Hot tag. Missed. <laughs> hot tag. Shit. Sorry, I'm, I'm tagging back out. Where the... Where the build of you? Take down the getaway. All right, I will. <laughs> All right, I will. Right, yo. You're not in this tag team match, but you can run interference. <laughs> Oh, that's not the one I was thinking of, but never mind, it'll do. Oh, I hit the cop car. We're not acting for the police car this time, AJ, for fuck's sake. This is what the world's wildest police chases wishes it was. World's wildest acid trips. Boom! And then hot tag. Oops! This guy. The phone box is flying up in the. There's lampposts flying everywhere, it's carnage. Right, you. Speed. And then, oops. All right, and then if we, yes. You see, Nodge, there you go. He's running on fumes. Hey, there we go. Oh, we've got a nice new selection of missions now. Okay, so, complete, oh, hello. Oh, I, I forgot this. When you're in a police car, there's certain cars that are marked in red. You can see the dots on the map. If you nudge them, you instigate get a getaway. Well, this man looks a bit sus. I don't know why. He just does, apparently. But our police car's a bit knackered, so we're out of here. We're going to peace out, and we're going to do some more of these side missions. Did someone say something about a Dodge Monaco earlier, by the way? Because I think I just saw there was one. Here, there we go. Here's a Dodge Monaco. Not a police car, but still. Close enough. There was humming the Blues Brothers theme all of a sudden. Yeah. So... 
So, over here, what's this? Mission from God. Take down the This is getting a bit Blues Brothers all of a sudden. A church? They broke into a church? Yeah, and stole the poor box. I've had a bad day. I'm in a bad mood, and these guys are going to ruin it. All right. Day. Amen to that. Oh, yeah. All right. We've got a pair of angry bad bitches up in here. <laughs> we ain't pulling punches with these guys, no. are we? I've waited years to say this. Say what? We're on a mission from God. <laughs> <laughs> Who was it earlier that said Sassy Tanner is best Tanner? Oh, we've got tag team mechanics going on as well. The getaway is in a Ford F-150 by the look of it. Oh! And then, oh, and then, boom! Oh, yes! The tag team is working perfectly. Oi, where do you think you're going, mate? Where do you think you're going, mate? It's like having my own cheering section. I love it. Oh, I think some of the HGVs were licensed in this game as well, uh, Nay. I think. So where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going, mate? Where do you think you're going, sunshine? Oh, by the way, time for the hot tag. He's about to run wild. He's about to run wild. Runs wild. Options, options, options. The tag team partner's overshot. Nope. Cubes, never mind. Go for you. Oh, no, you're way back. You, you're best placed. Sassy Tanner is... Oh, fuck. I'm, fuck, I missed the turning. Quickly, go. Out the way. Still calibrating? Yeah. <laughs> no bad driving. <laughs> I'll let it slide. Thank you. you got to trust me, I've had a weird day, all right? <laughs> you just got me. You just got me patient with me. I've had a weird day. Boom! Oh, yeah. Have some of that. Another happy ending. On your fight. No. <laughs> Take down. Oh, yeah. Oh, most of the heavy vehicles are fictional cars. Okay. Did not know that. All right, so we've got four missions. Well, one of them is a story mission, which is a padlock at the moment, which is no fun. So, AJ, what? You were saying about Tobias being horny. Was I? Oh, well, well that's just me. <laughs> do you expect that? Tobias is supposed to be on the job. Even though I don't think he's got much to do while Tanner's just like... <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, dude. Yo, bro. Yo, bird. Y'all, uh... Off in someone else's body right now. <laughs> just trundling around on another part, and then all of a sudden... Duh! Right, Jones, we need to go and arrest this guy now. And Jones like... Where the fuck did you come from? Just waking up out of nowhere. Waking up in Vegas. Not quite. That's quite beyond our shift capabilities right now. <laughs> Ooh. Fuck it, we'll do that. These dares are quite nice because you're just wandering around the map looking for other things. And you're like, oh, I'll do that. Oh, I'll do that. Sorry. 25 vehicles in 60 seconds, you say. Okay, I think we can do that. All right, so there's one, two. Bearing in mind, oncoming counts as overtakes as well. So let's go out on the open road. One, yeah, here we go. The numbers are mounting. We have the numbers now. It's all just a constant illusion of control. Break us like horses. How long will we tear their plow? What will continue to be is what we allow. Yeah, don't mind me just casually singing some Rise Against songs over here. You're mute. Nearly there. We've got 21 seconds to go. There we go. Yeah. Okay. And then nice. Right, where were we? We were looking for this mission. <laughs> Sorry, we're actually looking for a mission. Do, 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 do. Oh, here we go. Right, what's this? Take down the street racers. They're breaking the law. Breaking the law. Break, breaking the, the law. All right, I will. <clears throat> Look, 
There's a reason I'm driving the car, Preston. Someday when you've got more experience. Oh, Shavik Kowalski, pulling over these jerks isn't gonna do anything. They're breaking the law. I'm gonna get them off the streets and maybe save some lives. All right, whatever. Easy peasy. Right, here we go. I got a love-hate relationship with street racers. Love-hate? Hate not getting an invite to the race. Love crashing the party. <laughs> Sassy Tanner is out here again. All right, so we've got four street racers out here. So let's take down... Boom! The first one. Oh, that's an R33 sure skyline. Oh, there's another R33 oh, well, skyline. I don't want to do this. Like this game's well. mean. Okay, it's time to introduce these guys to some walls. All right, so we have to take these guys down before the race finishes, so... Boom! Oof! <laughs> we missed... We glanced one and then immediately went head on into another. All right, here we go. <laughs> yes! Never gets, old. Never gets old. I agree, Tanner. I agree. Uh, schools in session. Who's next? Schools in session. Bulbs. Oh, no, that's our car. Scratch one. Who's up next? Right. There's the others. Right, here's the route of the street race. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Out the way. Ready for some excitement? Believe I'm gonna do my best. Drive like you're in a coma. Boom! Close that one. Boom! Oh, that Got that one. Oh, oh boy. Oh, it's not 33 Skyline. Do, do this. Two. Remaining? Two. We must uh, keep focused on the job. Keep focused on the job. It's like the episode of Top Gear where they, they blow up that guy's Mitsubishi Evo. It's like. Oh! How are you enjoying the ride so far, hot shot? That's oh, did we just do a double takedown? Did we just do a double takedown? Yes, we did! I hope we can all take something away from this. <laughs> double the double kill. <laughs> double takedown. Oh, boy. That was an aftertouch takedown right there. Someone fancies clipping that. Please do. That was baller. Accelerate 0 to 170 miles an hour and no abilities. I feel like I need a better car for that. Not that the charger isn't good or anything, but... Right, so the Tanner mission has unlocked, but, but, the, but that's... The, the, that's boring. You don't want that. You don't want to just do the missions. Take down the street races. Oh, you mean like we just did? I can do a bit more of that. <laughs> then buy a better car. Exactly, yes, Oriel. That's what, yes. <laughs> All right, where we go? What cars are these guys driving? Ah, they're driving muscle cars. Well, I still don't take much pleasure in destroying them, but, you know, they're owned by Norbed, so... We move. Right, and there's a bus. Oh god. Oh, this is good. This is about to be real scary hours. Real scary hours. <laughs> oh, that was a viper. Oh, Rhino somewhere is just crying. Rhino is just sobbing in anguish. Very sorry. You know I had to do it to him. You know I had to do it to him. So of course I was right. And I don't care. Wrong. I just don't know what you're talking about, mate. Hang on, are there more, more, ca <laughs> more cars in this race? One hit kill. Have I done the race side missions? I think I have. Right. Sorry, I know there's a, a jet garage nearby that really needs this, but, you know. <laughs> the real reason there's a petrol shortage in the UK. Some psycho keeps nicking the oil tankers and using them as weapons. All right. Sit there, keep quiet. Let me do what I got to do. No problem. No. What <laughs> Way to help with the fuel shortage. I know, right? That's the real reason. There's a shortage of drivers. Yeah, because they're, they're busy being taken over by John Tanner and being used as improvised weapons. Oh, my God. We're barely at the fourth. Oh, speaking of which. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did you want to get to work tomorrow? Well, unfortunately, here's what's going to happen to the fuel that was going to go in your car. Oops. Oh, my God. D -d -d Double kill. Again. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can someone clip that as well, please? <laughs> D -d -d Double kill. Tanner's on a mad one. Tanner is on an absolute madness. Tanner is on a madness. Hector's on fire today. Your defense is terrified. Your street racers are terrified. Tanner's on fire. <laughs> Jericho is terrified. Right. Let's go to our garage, shall we? 
absolute madman. You know. Whew, okay. Oh, I love this game so much. <laughs> you may be able to tell. Tow a vehicle open. We're so doing that. Right, first, let's go to our safe house. Garage, whatever. Honestly, though, I really feel like there is a chance. Imagine this game. Like, imagine, like, Neves Be Carbon or Neves Be Most Wanted, the original, but with this graphics and this physics engine. Just imagine that. Because bizarrely, that's one thing I never really clicked with in the Neves Be games, especially Carbon, because I don't think they did the police thing as well as Most Wanted. But I never quite clicked with the whole thing of it felt predetermined. It was like they're just going to keep up with you and you kind of have to hit predetermined things to destroy cop cars. Whereas in the driver games, you could kind of use your intuition a bit more, like drive around obstacles and lose them that way more organically. I lo would love it if they combined the two like that. Um, Range Rover, IUF, Vauxhall. Oh, by the downtown garage. Oh, meantime. How much have we got? Income multiplier. Oh, I'm sure we can buy that. I like the police stuff in Most Wanted and Carbon, but I do agree. Late stage police chases were horrible. Yeah, exactly, right? It was like, it was very like, you must use Pursuit Breakers, otherwise you're just not going to ever lose the cops. I'm like, yeah. I grew up on the driver games, like I said, where it's a lot more organic. You could actually ram cars with your car. You didn't have to wait for bits of, for buildings to fall on people. No, wait, that's split stroke second. <laughs> that's split stroke second, colon velocity. Right. So, where's the downtown garage? Uh, excuse me. Uh, oh, is this it over here? <clears throat> Alright, we can't actually go to things in this view, but... Plenty of time. 45 minutes still. <clears throat> Intriguing. Like that one. Oh, what was the... Oh, we were going to do a tow truck dare, weren't we? No, if we can find a tow truck dare, I'm doing it. I'm gonna. Just need to try and find... I'm just going to try and find the downtown thing. What's this? Handbrake stop 80 meters. Pretty, uh, pretty wild. Up here. And where are we on the map? Oh, right. We're... That was not garage. I'm an idiot. Uh, I am an absolute dingbat. Because <laughs> that is not a garage. The garage has a spanner on it. There's only one spanner around here at the moment. <laughs> Aha, there it is. The dares are brilliant, honestly. Like, there's just so much shit to do in this game. And it's all really fun. A getaway inspired by the President's run from Driver 1. What, you mean the final level of that game? <laughs> yeah, about that. Aha, here we go. It's over here. There it is. Gotta go north. Ooh. Ooh, boy. Oh, boy. Ah, Roy. <laughs> we can't afford them yet. Camaro. My knees are trembling. My knees are actually weak right now. Drivers. Uh, so, vehicles. Oh, yeah, I've got the Jaguar XFRs in this. Now, there are three worlds that will make acting nurse a semi. You know, there's no lie there. I'm not detecting any lies. Right, so... <clears throat> when I was 12, I beat that final level of Driver 1 first try by sheer universal... Holy sh... I respect you for that, man. That's... Yeah. Right, so there's no other garages on the map by the look of it for the moment. Even ones that are unoccupied. So... Let's go... But What the... Why is something being pointed out to us? Something down here. Something down here. Something down here. Is this like a secret one or something? No, it's just a thing. Oh, I know this one. City Hall Sprint. Why the, why the hell not? A solo checkpoint route. Got to do it in two minutes, and I believe 
Our weapon of choice for this run is a McLaren MP4-12C. I'll say I'm good with that noise. You want to come for a ride in my MP4-12C? Yes, let's go. It sounds tasty. It sounds very sexy. Yeah. Oh, it's got it's got a flap. It's got a flap. It's like, oh my god, yesterday. I was watching the it was during the IndyCar race. Now bearing in mind for context, I'd have the shittiest day as a race fan ever. With the whole, you know, Lando Norris in Russia the the, the Sochi screw job in Russia with Lando. I even switched over to the British Touring Cars. Yeah, maybe that can cheer me up. Oh, my favourite driver, Josh Cook, got a second... Uh, no, he got DQ'd on a bullshit technicality. For fuck's sake, why does everything hate me? Oh, well, maybe there's IndyCar. Oh, my boy could go for the chat. He's been taken out on the first lap of DNF. I hate everything. I'm going to go and become a golf fan now. I hate most sport. But when we I was in a watch party with a few mates of mine watching the, um, the IndyCar race, which is still a good race. Uh, and hey, you know what? Stoke for Alex Polo. Very deserving champion. Very cool to see a new champion in the series and all that. Whoops! <laughs> I didn't even know that was the ramp there. Never mind. <laughs> we move. So she, so she's. <laughs> um, yeah, what was I saying? Yes. During that, there was one point where someone in the group chat went, "Yeah, it was, it's, I was following a lorry the other day, and I saw the company name for the the mud flaps on the lorry was actually called Beefy Flaps." <laughs> no joke. I was crying with laughter so hard, I got a headache. <laughs> you know, you just need that one thing to really cheer you up when you've had a shite day. <laughs> this is a real company. I shit you not. Beefy Flaps are a real company. <laughs> if you go to Google, beefy-flaps.co.uk, it's a real website. I'm not, I'm not shitting you. It's memorable and descriptive. <laughs> oh, I'm so immature. I'm really immature. You may, may have guessed, guessed this already. Oh, God. Okay. All right, so we go over here. What's this race mission about over here? Well, I assume it's, there's a flag on it, so there's a flag on the play. Race, double or quits. All right, finish the race first or second. Oh, we're driving a DB9 Aston. One of my favorites. I put down every dollar. Oh, it's our guys time. from um, double our Street Race Before. I told you, I barely remember racing. Whatever you did, just do it again, John. Oh, God, because we, we, we put him in, up, a, in a no-win uh, situation. Well, you funded my you way through college idiot. before. You can do it again with your amazing street racing techers. Dude, I, I don't know how I did that. I genuinely don't know. But luckily, Tanner is back to mystically give this guy driving ability. Well, they have upgraded since last time. Hang on. You ready to double our money? That's a hell of a responsibility to dump on my yeah. shoes. Uh, oh. <laughs> well, I mean, that's what you get. You may have had right of way there, but that's what you get when pulling out in front of a bunch of street racers. Really? What are you doing? Also, I'm starting... I'm that's smelling something a bit fishy here. Love. Believe me, it isn't. I'm starting to smell something a bit fishy here. They said they used the funds in the first race to put their mate through college. Your man through college. All of a sudden, they've now got an Aston Martin convertible. Very smooth. I'm like, oh no, we yeah, need to do another I'm race for more money for ninja. um, um yeah. Whatever. Uh, uh, good question, yeah. actually. I just want to buy more cars. You know, I respect it. You, you just got to be honest. You know, you just got to be upfront, especially when your friends out here. Oh yeah, number one. Ow! Number one. Why did you have to say that? Why did you, you've literally jinxed us? Look, oh, we've got a Porsche Cayman. Another uh, Aston Martin. Around the highway. This is very Neebs B Carbon at times, and I'm okay with that. Maybe that's one reason I love this game so much down the years. It's like a better Neebs B Carbon. And Neebs B Carbon is probably. Maybe on balance my favourite Neebs Speed of all time. That and Underground 2. Because I'm one of the weird people oh, yeah, that doesn't think Most Wanted was great in series. But oh, God. But I can see. That was Nay manifesting himself to be like, how dare you? But I do agree it's an amazing game. I just preferred car, we but I just have preferred Cabron. I preferred Need Speed Cabron. Right, ooh, cool. Yeah. There we go. You keep this up, and I swear, if you ever need a kidney, I'm your guy. Why are we talking organ donation? I'm just saying. I'm grateful. <laughs> I'm just saying. I feel like that's how it's going to end. <laughs> Either we're going to win the street race, or I'm going to require new organs. Oh! Hey, I'm just 20 weeks to subscribe. Yeah, Thank you. That's very kind of you. How many new subs is that? Well, 
not just new subs, but recurring subs today. That's like four or five, isn't it? Oops. Yeah, okay, eyes on the road, AJ. Eyes on the road. What are you talking about? We're kicking ass. Ayumu, it won't always be this way. What, you're magically going to forget how to drive like this? <laughs> yeah, believe it or not, <laughs> it kind of is. <laughs> Meantime, though. We just it's got rich. Yes, we did. Road ice. We should do this for a living. Oh, jeez. All right, so we'll uh, we'll leave those crazy college kids in if it's crab. We'll leave those crazy college kids to uh, continue their life of illegal street racing, which you know, as a way of funding yourself through college, not a bad way of doing things. Oh my god, another sub! Oh my god, that's five gift subs! Holy cheeseburgers! What is going on out here? What is happening? Genuinely, a bit, genuinely, <laughs> holy cheeseburgers! That's five gift subs there from a underscore t twenty rex who just subscribed as well. Thank you so much, you beautiful bastard. That's Ariel. Vets for everyone. Holy crap! So that's gift subs for Wesley, Rune the Andrian, Nay, Professor Hitch, and Two Reaver Seven. <laughs> Windows XP startup. It's just going mad at the moment. Corvettes for everyone. Oh, yeah. Spam the Corvette emotes in the chat. Oh, my God. Thank you, T20Rex. Appreciate that. That's so lovely. Well, how many subs is that now today? Flipping like 10 or something? I don't even know. I don't even know. And I appreciate all of it. I'm very grateful. Thank you. All right, that's please car. <laughs> just, just a wall of Corvette emotes in the chat. Things you love to see. Right. Let's go over here. What time is it, by the way? Oh, hello. That was it. That was it. Stunt, the big break. Gets the club before the show starts. All right, I will. Okay, yeah. 23. Okay. Uh, gets the club before the show starts. Okay. Listen to me, KP. Calm Listen down. to me, Kevin Put Peterson. Put pacifier back in your mouth and, uh... Hey, bitch. Your boy, little baby, been biting my rhymes. So tonight my crew's gonna bust up the launch party. Crazy P sounds real mad, Jackie. <laughs> what you gonna do, asshole? The venue's a secret. Secret? You got signs all over town, you ass clown. <laughs> I'll see you later, JP. I really don't understand what's really going on here, but, you know... Someone called someone else an, uh, an ass clown, so I respect it. Ah, the Cadillac XLR. Yeah, nice. Ah, so this is like Jesus your old... Um, Christ, I need little oh, what, was the, what were the name of those side missions the in previous driver games yeah, where you drive along? They were normally like cones. KP doesn't know where the show is, so we just smash all the street ads. Ah, I'll except there's no I linear route for this one, I don't think. The brain's new. Yeah, there's no linear, um... I don't think there's a linear route for this. Riff-raff between rap. It's supposed to be riff-raff Oh, hang on. Uh, 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 sorry. Watch it, pal. I'm extremely litigious. Uh, 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 you're extremely what? You're extremely contagious. Get away from me. <laughs> Get away from me, ma'am. <laughs> Still can't get a riff-raff between rappers. You want me to stop your... You want me to stop your show being shot up tonight, don't you? Do you want to pipe down, ma'am? Do you want to pipe down, flipping Karen? You still think you're gonna bust up the party tonight, KP? If it ain't tonight, it's gonna be soon. Ha! Little Bay's gonna be so huge after this drops, you're gonna need a bulldozer to get past his entourage. Well, steady. The mission ain't complete yet. Uh, ma'am. Uh, we've got a movie token. Uh, nice. She has the T virus. <laughs> That's your zombie. How many have we got? Oh, there's loads of them. There's fucking loads of them. Do we have to get all of them? I'm not seeing any counter that says you do. What? You don't know the difference between the road and the sidewalk? I know. I just don't care. <laughs> <laughs> ah, once again, sassy Tanner is best Tanner. <laughs> you know, Michael Madsen's an awesome voice actor, but dark, gritty Tanner from Driver 3 ain't got nothing on sassy as shit Tanner. You they had time. Oh, okay. If I don't take down those signs, there won't be a gig to go to. I tell you what, someone has been working hard with their like street, <laughs> with their like guerrilla marketing campaign. Ha! Good luck 
I'll tell you what, Kevin Peterson is on a madness here. He's really determined to shut down this concert or whatever. <laughs> oh, that was bollocks. No, no, please, please. Bonk. There we go. She just has the affluent. Oh, sorry. Oh, Jesus. I've only just got that. Oh, that's some highbrow. Oh, oh, seriously. <laughs> bonk. Bonk, bonk. And then bonk. And then bonk. Oh, I see. Yeah, so it is the entire roll. Oh, shit. Oh, please. No, please. <laughs> bonk. It's a real thing. Oh, is it? There we go. Yo, KP, you know where Little Bay's gig is? No, you don't. Ha! I can't find the goddamn gig. <laughs> okay. and I'm gonna have to Fuck. take you out instead. I've been defeated. Yeah, yeah, KP, you're all mouth and no. Nope. Do you think there's someone in KP's car that's like, yo, dog, just, can you not just look on Google? <laughs> can we not just Google the address of the club? Now, <laughs> fuck. God damn it. <laughs> have the wiki page and everything. What does it mean? Street billboards and the new cones, innit? Right, well, we got a Tanner mission, but you know, I feel like we should save that for our stream main event. So, uh, for the moment, and was that Chevy Volt? Oh my god, I forgot that was in this game. He knows about us, Michael. I'm sure of it. Yeah, whatever. Just a car where relax. the tire squealing yeah, is definitely going to be louder than the motor. Me. Please do not adjust your sets. Does it still boost as normal? Electric charge. This fucking fan boost. Formula E fan boost. <laughs> oh, what's this? <clears throat> Speed deer. Drive over 140 miles an hour in first person view. All right. Well, I don't think we'll be doing it in that car. So uh, let's find a car more suited for the job, shall we? A late model Camaro. How's your first driving lesson going so far, sis? I think I've got the hang of it. I'm sorry, this... You're doing your first driving lesson in a Camaro SS. Big man. There we go. EZ. <laughs> EZ. It's more or less, I'm so rich I don't know the concept of my actions having conflict. Oh, well, there you go. There was a Cadillac version of this car. What one? Oh, the Volt. What was it? The Cadillac Buzz. What was that? It's a GMC Vandura. Was this not in um, Forza? Oh, also, what's the change view button? Oh, it's select. Too close, there we go. Too close. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this was in Forza Horizon. It was. Nice. Right, let's have a cruise around. Tow truck. Oh, ramp truck. <laughs> nice. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> the 18 van. Yeah. <laughs> Viper. Remember, boo, she's my hyper glide honey ride. She's she's Whatever. not yours anymore. She's also not yours anymore. Ooh, boy. <laughs> oh, we need to find a ramp truck for this. We need to find a ramp truck for this. Oh god, a V10. I know, right? The same V10 then decided to be a great idea to put in a Dodge Ram pickup as well. Oh my god, Rezzy's... Rezzy with the subscription. Well, on an 18-month streak, I've lost count of the amount of subs we've got today. Either resubs or, um... Subs... Well, we got five gift subs a bit ago. Everyone's... You realise how much your tyre's gone? Ma'am, why did you buy this car if you were concerned about replacing the tyres on it? Uh, that's just a simple question I have for you, really. Uh, so anyway, hello, Rezzy. How you doing? We were, um, you know, just oops, just out here uh, driving the Rhino Nutsmobile. What was that? Ooh, what is? Challenge. A modern muscle race through downtown and Russian Hill. All right. I will do that. Unfortunate. Spam the Corvette Shakabra. <laughs> Shuck a bra. Okay, here we go. Oh, we're in another nice modern Dodge. 
the modern challenger big fan of that win the downtown race all right then i will it's in these street races that it does feel very Need Speed Carbon HD remaster. Even though technically Need Speed Carbon was in HD when it was on the Xbox 360 and uh, PS3. I always find it weird, and it was a bit of a halo moment when I found it, that the collector's edition for, next, for, for then current gen, there was a collector's edition for the PS2, a collector's edition for the Xbox 360, but no collector's edition for the PS3. So if you wanted basically the ultimate carbon, you know, best graphics and with the collectible uh, the collector's edition bonus stuff you have to get the 360 version oh and on pc as well yes what are you doing what are you doing you pillow? don't want to go over a ramp truck this time oh the growling hemi the growling hemi i think he's in my dad's truck would you stop that would you stop that there we go. Never mind. Boost gets that. Just like needs to be carbon. Boost gets you out of any situation. Out of the way. Sorry. <laughs> My poor challenge has been punched in the face a bit, but you know. We do what we need to do, you know. He didn't choose this life. Thirteen out of twenty-three checkpoints. Target's four minutes on the clock, so we should beat that. Whether we are the first to beat it or whether someone else does it first. It's still up for debate. Oh, oh, well, okay. We've just landed ourselves straight in a trap. Oh, that was smooth. That was smooth. That was a total traffic jam. We just ended up just piling straight into, and we actually survived it quite well. Oh, someone's there. Who's that? Oh, it's a Mustang. Wait a minute, we're in a Dodge being pursued by a Ford Mustang around the streets of San Francisco. You know, uh, the situation, I find it very nostalgic. Because when is that Revolver Ocelot quote never not appropriate? I remember me and uh, an old mate of mine back in secondary school, we actually did our own like spoof, like satirical skit version of uh, Metal Gear Solid 2. But it was like an audio, it was like an audio version. Very much like there was, I'm pretty sure there was a, something like that for Metal Gear Solid 3. Um, all I remember from our version of Metal Gear Solid 2, it was quite funny. Um, had some mildly funny jokes, if you know Metal Gear Solid 2, I guess. Uh, I just remember I ended up voicing Revolver Ocelot and had quite a good version of his voice. The situation, I find it very nostalgic. Cue the bullet music. <laughs> Speed! Boost out the final corner. And across the line. Lovely jubbly. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Holy shit, what, what a return stream, I've got to say. Playing one of my favourite games of all time. We've had two separate tips and about... I don't even know how many subs. In this hole, I'm giving myself to my 30th birthday to go full-time on Twitch and YouTube. Not a bad way of starting out, I've got to say. <laughs> so, uh, right, more shit to do. Let's find some more shit to do. Let's go. Hang on. Let's... Hang on, I think there's something on the map that's... De no, hang on, we need, we need to go... No, we need... Uh, it, it, it's a bit... There, yeah, right. Something on the map. It's under here. There we go. It's a movie token. Okay. Speaking of bullet. Yeah, let's get this. Let's get this quick. Oh, it's a Ford Taurus SHO. Oh, no. It's up on the... Uh, it's on the wrong road. There we go. This will do. No, oh, it's another Caddy XLR cable. <laughs> it's another Cadillac XLR cable. Soon to be followed up by their new uh, people carrier, the Cadillac HDMI. Cadillac CN Lite version. Yeah, kind of. Pretty much. Oh, is that another movie token? Oh, yeah. 
Okay. Ooh. We're doing that. We are so doing that. Why is this flashing us? Should we do that first, or is that just the thing we should do? Game, why do you want us to do this thing? It's binging at us. Oh, here we go. It's the challenge we've just unlocked. <laughs> Get the CCS food now, the Cadillac like USB C. <laughs> okay. So. This game has a thing where you can recreate certain iconic car chases from films. Are any of you aware of a film called Gone in 60 Seconds? No, not that one with Nicolas Cage and the silver Eleanor Shelby Mustang. The original Gone in 60 Seconds. Yes, it was a low-budget movie in the 70s about a bunch of car thieves who were just like, we've got to steal a bunch of cars for uh, a, a, a crime boss. All right. Yeah. The Gone in 60 Seconds Nicolas Cage version doesn't really have much to do with it. All you need to know about the original Gone in 60 Seconds is that the final chase is epic. And the chase car gets beaten the fuck out. <laughs> it's a brutal chase. And so much of the stunts were actually just illegal. They only had one car for the whole filming, so any damage it got just... Yeah, exactly. We're now about to play that chase in this game. Here we go. <clears throat> Target 420 plays it. Let's do it. Oh my god! Attend a donation from Nay. Holy shit. Like I said, this whole maybe going full-time as a content creator thing. <sighs> Fucking off to a good start. Thank you all, everyone. You're all very lovely. About to get emotional over here. You're making me show emotions and shit. Oh, look at this. The film grain filter. No shifting, no abilities. Get on the leaderboards. Improve your rank by replaying. All right, then. Let's go. Where we go. So it's a standard checkpoint race, but with cops in pursuit. With all the cops in the city after us. Which is realistic to the actual Gone in 60 Seconds film chase. Oh, and all the police cars are old school. Oh my god. Yep, they're all old Dodge Monaco police cars. And I think all the cars on the roads that are spawning are all vintage cars as well. It's like all period correct cars. This is great. Ah, oh, this is awesome. Love this game so much. Oh, hitch to redeem, make a cup of tea. I had one at the start of the stream. I'll uh, remind you of old survival mode. It very much is. We've never had anything quite as batshit insane as that in the game. Whoa! <laughs> 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 mm -hmm. My arsehole is the size of a pinhead right now. Oh, movie token, movie token, movie token. Whoops! That's a staircase. I can just hear loads of sirens. That was 100% a brown pants moment. You don't say. Christ, oh Christ, oh Christ, oh Christ. I can just hear sirens. And that marker on the side is just all over the place. It's like, there's two cop girls after you. Now there's five. Now there's 20. Now there's two again. Now there's 25. <laughs> Believe it or not, we've briefly lost them. <laughs> we've briefly lost the police. <gasps> okay. Oh, <laughs> these cars are just spawning from rooftops. Key and stretch. That was 100% of brown pants, babe. Really? Well, oh no! You never take me alive, coppers. No, no. Ow! Yes, fuck you. Fuck all of you. Still going. Fuck you. <laughs> you never take me alive, coppers. I'm stealing this Mustang. It's the last thing I do. I'm supposed to not hit that truck. <sighs> Come on. Come on, old Mustang. Come on. I have toys now. Hey. Everyone's got toy Corvettes to play with in chat. Oh, God. Oh, oh burgers. Oh, burgers. Oh, the sidestep. The swerve. The swerve, bro. Vince Russo would have been proud of that. Oh, oh. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Shit! It's a bit! Uh, I didn't manage to survive that one! Okay, this is quite realistic to the film chase now. The Mustang is very beaten up. Ow, ow, ow! Did he? No, come on! No! 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 You never take me to life, filth! <laughs> I'm just making, like, birth noises now. <sighs> this is shit! Ow! 
I'm being pounded. Ow. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Just let them sweep past you like a tidal wave. Everyone's like, I came in like a Ricky Balls. No, no, no. I'm supposed to. No. Why are you doing that? You cruel individuals. Oh, we're nearly there. We're nearly there. Come on. Literally, the bridge is round this corner. Doing God's work. Slowest clipper in the world at the surface. Hey, thanks for the clip, Nate. Come on. Come on, the, the bridge is there. Please. Please. No. No. Screw you. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it, lads. I'm going to do it. Yes. I crossed the line. Cheese it. I'm going to cross the line. Mm. Oh, my God. That was fun. Oh, that was good. Holy cow. Okay. <clears throat> Woohoo. That was a lot of fun. Give me this some beans. <laughs> really are. Is that, is that a movie token? Tag five taxis in 30 seconds. Oh, I will. And enough WP to buy myself a new car. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to. All right, give me some taxis to boop. I want to boop some taxis. All right, there's one. And boop. And then how many taxis do I need to boop? Five. All right. Mumbo number five. One, two, three, four, four, four. Taxi drivers must die. Oh, yeah. Bonk. And then, oh, shit. And then, bonk. There we go. <laughs> I even bonked an extra one. Just, just for completion's sake, you know? Anyway, let's go to our, uh, go to our garage. Over here somewhere. There it is. There we go. <coughs> Making it look easy. Thank you. Ability bar size. Oh, yes. Thank. Very grateful for that. Oh, we're supposed to be buying new cars with this money. Oh, never mind. Can't do that yet. Okay, we can't un haven't unlocked those yet. So. Oh, it's the XLR Dash V apparently. We could legit afford a vet. Uh oh. <laughs> well, we could. <laughs> Never mind. We'll just have to do more of the. Uh... We'll just have to do more of the uh, the side missions. Ooh. We'll have that. We'll have a challenger. Oh god. Yes, please. <clears throat> See what else we can buy for the moment. Volkswagen Scirocco R. Say that. Nice mechanic for the game, to be honest. Uh, how much have we got left? Ooh, we can buy a Trans Am. Always nice. Do that. Ooh, Solstice GXP. It's not quite... Now you can make the challenge yellow to match the old one. Yeah, you know? Yeah, so it's not quite a Corvette Drift. But it's a General Motors sports car in drift configuration. You know, I'd say it's close enough. <coughs> May as well pick up the solstice, the regular solstice as well. I don't know if there's any more we can afford right now. <laughs> the poor Crown Victoria is 500 credits. It's a solstice with a Formula D kit. It really is. Okay. Doink man. Uh, Audi, no. Alfa Romeo, why not? Okay. <clears throat> the double income boost would be a good investment. I think we have it. Hang on. Income multiply. Yeah, we do. We need to complete 14 more dares to unlock the next one. Whew. Man, I need that one IRL. Which one's that? The income, oh, the double income booster. Oh, did I select the Trans Am to drive around in? Oh, nice. All right, more vintage GM muscle. I can vibe with that. Hey, Mike, quickly, get Bert. This is the car that he's named after, isn't it? Technically. Well, he's named after Bert Reynolds, but, you know. Is it this model that he runs in the Smokey and the Bandit films? Or is it the slightly later 70s one? Both sexual, not the... Ah, I see, yeah. This is the slightly earlier one, isn't it? I think I slightly prefer this one, but there's not really much in it. 
Like, you can give me the keys to either. I'm not going to go, oh, no, I prefer the other one. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> right, anyway. So. Oh, I wish we could find. I want to see if we can find that. Uh, well, there's the Tanner mission. That'll be our stream main event. You know, please work. Oh, we can also do that. Just jump back in our car if we want to. Oh, it's actually a later one. Okay. <clears throat> um, I really want to see if we could find that debt. Oh, what's this? Ah, we're not doing that. The early one is the more rectangular front. Oh, I see. Yeah, I think I know the one you mean. Right. Uh, yep, no, we're good. Oh, what does that unlock, though? Ford Grand Victoria. We've done that already, haven't we? Well, the Ford Crown Victoria, we just bought that at our garage, so... I just remember the tow truck mechanics in this game. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mid-chase, we managed to tow a cop car. It was wonderful. Stay above 60 for 20 seconds. May as well. Oh, the cop car, I see. All right, so nice straight road. Here we go. Where we go? Just cruise it along. Ah, this is the earlier model. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Oops. Still doing 90 miles an hour, clanging through lampposts. That's just the techers we got out here. The one in driver is a 1974. Okay, right. All right, so there's there's a certain, like, dare or side challenge that we saw earlier. We said we'd go back to. We never did. I'm going to find it if it's the last thing I do. It will probably be the last thing I do, but, you know. Oh, yeah, we've done that. Uh, oh, follow from Lloyd 0901. How are you doing? If you're, if you're human... I hope you're doing well. If you're a bot, you can fuck off. Oh, Smokey and the Badness one was actually a different model in all of the films. Right. So, not that one. Uh... Oh, hang on. It's here, isn't it? Oh, it's a movie token. Okay. 77, 81, and 83. Well, given how he drove the uh, car in those films, he probably needed a new one after every film. Oh, what the? Oh, they're all movie tokens. Okay. A 30-meter jump in thrill cam. Well, you know, there just so happens to be a ramp nearby with some movie tokens on it, so we can kill two birds with one stone here. Oh. <laughs> well, what's the point in that? <laughs> we don't even have thrill cam yet. Or do we? Yeah, we don't. We don't have the thrill cam. Oh, never mind. Whee! All right, in which case, let's go find something else to do. What's this? Classic race along the west coast of San Francisco. All right, we'll do that. Accepting this will cancel your current debt. Well, we can't do our current debt. Yeah, I know it's a purchasable upgrade. I just wasn't sure if it was... Oh, someone redeemed Stretch a moment ago, by the way. Oh, oh. Ooh. By Classic Race. Yeah, very classic. An Alpha Spider Duetto. Very nice. What are our opponents driving? They in similar... Jeez. Okay, this car... This is night turning. I may, I may have broken this classic convertible like within seconds of starting the race. I think you're all in the same cars. I think so. This might be a one make race. This is a Gran Turismo one make race. The Caprio Caprio Challenge. <coughs> the Caprio Conundrum. Tell you what, that lad that I evicted from behind my monitor before the stream would have enjoyed this. It's a race full of spiders, lol. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. 
<laughs> yes, yeah, this old car was not really built for handling in my... I didn't need that. I didn't need that. Luckily, my mind powers can mean that I suddenly generate 500 horsepower worth of NOS. Yeah, it's amazing what mind powers can do. It's like those kiddie cars from back in the day. Oh, wait, that's their health bar. Ow! Um, where's the corner? Oh, it's up here. See what you did there. Thank you. Learned, I learned from uh, some very skilled pun masters in the chat. The doyens of punnage. While this car doesn't turn, I don't think this car was sold with the steering rack. Mind you, it is an old Alfa Romeo. The steering rack's probably rotted through. The steering rack's probably rusted and fallen off. Because it's handling like it doesn't have one. You want to turn? I've never known a small roadster. A small, agile roadster handles so non-agile. So un-agile-y. Never mind, we have speed! Oh, I don't have NOS in my car, I can't go fast. But do you believe that there's... But if you believe there's NOS in your car, you can manifest it. <laughs> Tires actually wheels of Italian cheese. You, you're not... You're not wrong, please. <laughs> I mean, that is a turning circle of about the orbit of Saturn. This is a turning circle that if we were lapping the rings of Saturn right now, we would struggle to actually make that turning circle. We would struggle to actually stay on the rings of Saturn with this turning circle. But never mind, we can manifest Norse. We can manifest Nitrous with the power of our mind. Maybe all those positive thinking gurus were right all along. Or maybe they were just actually full of shit. Never mind. All right, so there we go. Oh, okay. All right, we really should just go to the uh, stream main event now. Hopefully I'll be able to find the uh, tow truck dare we encountered earlier at some other point on the stream. But for now, let's go to our stream main event. Real police work, 99. How's it going? Ha <laughs> ha! Decided to pay us more Duh. of a visit, huh? How you doing, Jones? Yo, he's real here! Police work? Hit me. We got a tip on the car Sarah Allen spotted near the kidnap. The one belonging to our mysterious knife-wielding beauty? Well, things are looking up. And he wasn't talking about his pick. No, no, we're not gonna. That's sad. Okay, what's the deal? Tip is, there's a suspect vehicle matching the description in Midtown. Near Grace Cathedral. Ah, thank the Lord. Let's go. <laughs> thank the BB Jesus. I'll be honest, wasn't this description basically a white sports car? Dr. Allen described a white European sports car. We find the car, maybe we find out who the girl with the knife was. Clear a case for one. <laughs> thank the baby Jesus. <laughs> okay, uh, oh. We can't go down there. Damn it. Well, at least we're not against the clock. We'll just go up here instead. <clears throat> Sorry, I need to go down here. Oh, there's crows everywhere. Baby bell minis. Well then. Oh, hello. There it is. Yeah, we got a match. A white spot. Quick, take a picture. A white spot. Oh, hello. You look a bit sus. Got it. Woo! Baby, this girl is calendar material. We gotta get close. Hang on, let me, Swear there's hang on, let me get the horny truncheon out of the glove right, box. Tight, and I'll <coughs> see if we can get <coughs> Aston Rapide. I'm simping. <laughs> oh, God. Horny truncheons in the chat. We need to tail it? Yeah, we need to tail. Okay. Suspect suspicion. The suspect doesn't suspect anything. Hey, you're too close, Tan. Ah, Go this back, is a classic baby. driver mission. Do this, do that. When did we get married? <laughs> The sass between the two is great. The gay couple energy between the two is, is, is beautiful. So uh, we're just uh, trundling along here. 
runner plates, old-fashioned police work. Now you're talking my language. Control, this is 40 out of 30. Run this plate for us, would you? 8BR8139. Acknowledged. Yeah, I'm gonna shoot you a pick too. Suspect was pretty far away, but do the best you can. Understood. Alright, 10 full. Now, give us your drive and ask the mine. She ain't really driving it like one. She's sort of trundling along. Then again, she doesn't suspect we're being tailed. Doesn't suspect we're being tailed. Yeah, nice wide line through the corners, so the angle. 40 Adam 30, do you read? Yeah, we what do. What you got for us? The vehicle is registered to a 79 year old woman from Idaho. Yeah, right. Like grandma's gonna be rolling in a car <laughs> like that. We ran the picture through the national database, didn't turn up anything. Try Interpol control. I've got a bad feeling about this one. Stand by. Hey, put your foot down. She's pulling too far ahead. No, she's not. On it. You can see her, can't you? 40 out of 30, this is Control. Interpol got a hit on that visual. She's coming up as an American citizen of Egyptian descent. Uh, Leela Sharon. Leela Sharon. Leela Sharon. Imagine if she's Karen Sharon. Thanks, Control. Out. Temple. What, you know her? She's got quite a reputation. Not for her looks. Right. So what do you know about Are you still following her? her? She's a yeah, killer yeah. for hire. Cut her teeth in Africa. Whichever dirty war, whichever side, the girl knows how to So she was basically a protagonist yeah, well, from one I of the early Far Cry games. Her, so just... She's not your type, Jones. Unless you like girls who stab you on the first date. Pricey, <laughs> too. Only one crook in town's got the weight to put her on the table. Dear. Well, you don't know that. Do I need glasses? Because I swear she's almost out of sight. You're a real comedian, <laughs> Jones. I don't even want to talk over this. I can't even make jokes over the top of this because they're just... Their dialogue is just funny anyway. Oh. All right, anyway, we're heading up onto the bridge now. Woo! Just some casual power sliding. Well, following a suspect, you know. That's not suspicious at all. She's looking in her mirror. It's like, has that dodge been following me? And I'm like, yeah! Power sliding around. Do 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 do. Oh! John, what are you doing, man? She's right there. I can't go through that. Through what? Okay, we are definitely taking you to the hospital. This is affecting you, man. No, I'm fine. Look, we've got to let her go. Just trust me on this. For reasons of story continuity. Well, at least we know who we're looking for. She'll turn up again. In my dreams of nowhere else. Charles. <laughs> Bop. <laughs> the jelly barrier. <laughs> to be continued. It is. It is. Layla Sharon, assassin. Volkswagen you Sharon. Bet your life, she's our shooter from the helicopter, which means she's on Jericho's payroll. And if she fixed Sarah Allen's kidnapping too, that means Jericho needs a dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Previously, previously on, on Drive San Francisco, Francisco, some stuff that we just played through ten minutes ago. You got thirty more years. Jones, make, Jones, make sure you have a wank before coming to work tomorrow. Like, look, I'm not even in my body for most of the time. Jones could be there, like. You got Tanner in even in his buddy. He's off somewhere else. Just beat the meat. Although, to take the risk, just like Tanner comes back. Ugh. You right, Jones? Like, oh, put it away, man. <laughs> oh, fuck. You've come back in your body. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Anyway, can Jericho just not just head to boots if you need to care? <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, it's a fair point, really. Now, you're asking the real questions in here, as usual. <gasps> Here's our stream main event. There we go. We found it. So a vehicle over 85 miles an hour using a tow truck. Form this dare in a tow truck. You know what? I, I kind of figured that one out. All right, where's the tow truck? There's the tow truck. It's got a car already on the back. Here we go. Do we just have to get over 85 miles an hour? Spree oh, God. There we go. <laughs> we did it. We did it, ta-da! Do some, do some wild fish sailing, like, uh, wildly fish sailing dancing. Uh, Whoa! Uh, uh. Oh my God! Truckception. A tow truck over a ramp truck. <laughs> uh, Chevy Volt's never done 85 before. You know, I don't think you're right. I don't think you're wrong. And then, <laughs> oh, yeah. oh! I forgot you could turn like the sirens on on this. 
I'm going to try and use it as an actual pendulum to attack cars. Go on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Bonk. <laughs> this is so much fun. And then... <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Well, there's uh, nothing else but another Tanner Story mission to do. What's that blue triangle on the map? Oh, that's us. That's literally us. Okay. Um... I don't know, man. I want to find like one more challenge or something. Blood sugar place in the background. <laughs> um, what's this? Finish the open race in first or second. Unlocks the Arbor 500. Could do. Could do that. What's this over here? Perform a 30 meter drift in fuel cam. Okay. Just want to find something wacky to end the stream on, you know? Because that mission was kind of like just just drive after a person. Just drive around a bit. You could do a challenge from the go. <gasps> I could do that. Could do that. Could do that. All right, where is my garage? Well, there's one over here anyway. What's this? <laughs> Getting strapped again. Complete the smash route. Unlocks the DeLorean. <laughs> you know what test. Oh, while we're here, we can buy a bunch of upgrades and stuff, hopefully. Oop, grads. Oh, we can buy thrill cam now, because we're going to need that. The you know what test. What one's that? Challenges. I technically, I own all of those already. Special. Let's go into story mode. Russian Hill Racer. Russian Hill Relay. Taxi. You need a DeLorean for that. Oh, yes. Right. There was just a challenge there. There was just the challenge there that said we could unlock the DeLorean. Where was it? Is it this one? Yes! Smash Root! This is going to be our stream main event! <laughs> Alright, so we do this challenge, we unlock the DeLorean, we then buy said DeLorean, and then, uh, yeah, you'll have, our, uh, you'll have our stream main event. Said, if anyone knows what it is, I suspect at least a few of you do, um, don't spoil it. Meantime, we've got to do another Smash Root. Super Smash Bros. route. And then we do the secret TM, yeah. This is just a Nintendo announcement thing. Who's going to be the next character in Smash Brothers? Yeah, it's John Tanner. <laughs> Comes into every fight, just like Mario sat there, like, um, how do you use John Tanner in a fight? He just drives in his car and runs over Mario. But if you think about it, Super Smash Bros, if you, if you look at it from a different angle, it suddenly becomes a very dark game. Very dark and surreal. Princess Peach getting, Princess Peach getting stabbed by Solid Snake. You know, shit's wild. Shit's wild in that game. <laughs> Imagine John Tanner in Smash Bros. Tell you what, I forgot we just randomly spawned in a Trans Am, but it's doing the job. It's fast and it can break shit, so... I just need break stuff by uh, Limp Biscuit playing right now. It's just one of those days. We lightly nudged that car and it nudged us off course enough that we missed that sign. He jumps with the car. I've just thought of a parody solid state. Flaccid Gecko. Flaccid Gecko. <laughs> Is that like the Wayans Brothers parody version of Solid Snake? Flaccid Gecko. The name's Gecko. Flaccid Gecko. Why are you called that? I don't know. My writers thought it was funny, even though it fucking isn't. <laughs> even though it fucking isn't. No, you whoops. Ignore that. Physics. Some physics. Oh! Glancing blow on that sign there. Bonk. And then go down here. Bonk, bonk, bonk. And then, oh, bonk. How much time have we got? Oh, plenty. Bonk, bonk. And then, hey. <laughs> that was tech, because I used that truck. I nudged that truck into the sign and used him instead. I used you. Bonk. That was a vintage 67 Camaro there. Do you want to make your mind up as to whether you're still driving or not? 
And then... Oh! Wow. Never mind. That'll do. Smash route completed. Willpower rewarded. And now we can afford a DeLorean. Well, we've unlocked a DeLorean. Oh, okay. Sue! So, let's go get that DeLorean, shall we? You may be wondering. Why do we need a DeLorean so badly? Well, uh, you know, here's the thing. Let's go down to DeLorean. What's the DeLorean most famous for doing? Being in the Back to the Future films and traveling back in time when it hits 88 miles an hour. So, what do you think happens if you go 88 miles an hour in a DeLorean in a driver game? What do you think about that? There's only one way to find out, really. Let's go 88 miles an hour in a DeLorean in Driver. 88. Dun, dun, dun. We've just unlocked a challenge. Where is it? Whoops. Hang on. No, we don't need... We don't need you anymore, DeLorean. You have served your purpose. Are you the wheel man? Gee, it's funny, you know, because because the first driver game is technically called Driver. You are the wheel man. And it was also infamous for having one of the toughest first levels in gaming history. Which we are now go out to do ourselves. <laughs> This may be my favourite Easter egg in all of gaming history. Yep, we're doing a modern version of the Driver 1. Of the first mission from Driver 1. And I, I can't remember how it goes. I don't even know. So, hang on. Handbrake turn. Handbrake turn. Uh, the lap is around the outside, isn't it? How are we feeling, chat? Is this a good stream main event for you? We're not going to beat it this first time. We're doing exactly how you did in the original driver, which is figure out what the fuck you're supposed to do before you have a chance of even completing it. Oh, we did a lap. Uh, 360 spin. Yeah, laps around at the perimeter of the parking lot. Oh. 360 spin, 360 spin, 360 spin. 360 spin. Uh, speed! I think speed's down the middle, isn't it? Speed! Oh, speed and brakes just go uh, drive fast and go uh, break in a straight line. Right, okay. So, uh, yeah. Fucking love this Easter egg. Reverse one. Aha, uh -huh, okay. So, speed. And then. Reverse 180. There we go. And then we go into this and we go round here. We do our lap. I like the fact that somehow, even though this is still just as much of a bitch of a mission as the original, it's still somehow slightly easier than the original mission because, you know, walking on hot coals is probably slightly easier than this. Handbrake turn. And then straight into a 360 spin. 360 spin, 360 spin. Come on. Come on, there we go. Right, slalom, slalom, slalom. Oh, this is going to work out perfect. Come on. Slalom. 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 Is it that one you're supposed to do it on? Bollocks. Arse. Arsington's. Yes! Yeah, we did it. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think that will do it for today's stream. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, boy. Yep. Maybe the best Easter egg in gaming history. One of the greatest Easter eggs in gaming history. And uh, what a way to end off today's stream of one of my favorite games of all time. Thank you all for hanging out today. You've all made this uh, comeback stream, I guess. Uh, it is a comeback. It's a, it's a restart stream, I guess. You've all made this so much fun for me. Thank you for redeeming Hydrate. We'll do that. Um... Thank you all for 
A double Easter egg? Yeah, really? Yeah. Oh, boy. What was the other part of the Easter egg? Oh, the DeLorean. The De the oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on. No, what was it you were saying about uh, tow towing a cop car? Hang on a minute. No, come back. Oi. Oh, bollocks. Okay, this hasn't worked. Right, this, this hasn't quite worked. Right, you. I'm going to tow you. I'm towing a police car. No, it's going to stay. Come on, attach yourself to me again. Oh, the DeLorean. Oh, I didn't even clock that, you know. God, it just makes it even better. Right, can I just leave this? <laughs> can I just leave this pursuit in progress? I'm off now. Leaving the chase area. Yeah, I, I'm off. It's not my problem anymore. Oh, my word. Well, thank you all so much for hanging out today. Like I say, I really appreciate it. Um... This was... I just love this game so much. I can't think of a better way to get things back on the way on this uh, channel than that. What was it? Perform a 30 meter jump. Thank you for streaming. I appreciate it, Skelly. Thank you for being here. Thank you for all the subscribers, new and old. You're all astonishingly amazing people. I can't believe quite how many subs we've had today just in one go. That wasn't quite enough. Hey, there you go. Nice. Oh, Chevy Belair. Oh, I'll take that. Oh, yeah. Come on, player. We ain't no candy asses. Do you want we should blast? You heard me, home. Well, have I got the rock in the passenger seat? We ain't no candy asses. What are we driving? A Chevy Bell. It doesn't matter what we're driving. What are we playing this week? So what's coming this week? Well, on Wednesday, things should be back to normal on another station on the mile as well. That's gone through a subtle oh, rebrand, rearrange of things, a reshuffle, a not spring on. clean. Uh, so we should be back with that God, Thursday. Down. We'll now be back with the first. We'll be the out here again. with the first ever Rosetto sessions, um, which is basically me just arting around in a set of Corsa with mods and stuff, and doing a vaguely like Top Gear magazine show out of it. Because why the fuck not? Basically, I had an idea to start off with. Well, the episode's called Toyotas in Paris, so uh, yeah, it's themed around Le Mans Toyota race cars. So it'll feature the Moyoda hypercar. That has been made for the game, the night really cool mod uh, that's been made for the game. Oh, that's our car. Hang on. Oh, yeah, there's, a, there's our car just trying to go. You all right? Hello. You want a ball? Roll out, Pete. Missed the sale the first time when it came Yo, in just recently. Oh, yes. Excellent choice. Hey, who's the driver here? Excellent choice. Um. Yeah, so basically we'll be reviewing the Moyoda hypercar that's been released recently, the Payware mod from, oh, I can't remember the name of the site, but really good mod for a set of Corsa. Uh, and I think R Factor 2 bought a lot of his stuff already. It's great. So the Moyoda hypercar is, is basically the Toyota GR010, but it, it can't be called that for complicated legal reasons. Uh, and then, shall we say, we're going to find out how it stacks up against other Toyota Le Mans race cars from down the years. So that should be a lot of fun. Friday, another big old, another big old Let's Play begins. We're going to Grand Turismo 5, and I'm so excited. Grand Turismo 5, I really feel like, is potentially the most underrated game in the Grand Turismo canon. It can never live up to the hype and god-tier level of Grand Turismo 4, but it did a fucking good job of it. it. It came fucking close. It did really well. It's got a lot of cool stuff in it. Um, it's... It's a fascinating game. It's a fun game in many ways. And I'm really looking forward to going back to it. Um, and hopefully, given that we have a clear end goal for it, uh, are we doing the Nuzlocke thing in GT5? Probably. Probably, yeah. We will do that. Uh, most importantly, I'm going to try and finish this one because most of the Grand Turismo's have been just way too much for me to try and finish in a Let's Play series. Um, this one we're going to, and we're going to try and finish it by the time Grand Turismo 7 comes out. So it'll tie in with our PS5 GT7 quest that way. We're going to build up to Grand Turismo 7 by playing through Grand Turismo 5. The last quote-unquote traditional Grand Turismo in the series, GT6 changed a lot about it. GT Sport was basically a side game. It was not quite a regular Grand Turismo game altogether. GT5 is the last traditional one. GT7 seems to be going back in that direction. You know, with your, uh, with your home screen, your used car dealerships, your, your big sort of open world, sort of just a big sort of toy box full of cars and a love of racing, really. And I couldn't be happier about that. So 
in that vein, let's go back to the last game in the series that really did that. And enjoy the dodgy animatronic faces of 2010 Sebastian Vettel and Jeff Gordon, because they are something to behold. Hey, hey, GT6 was GT5 with no more fat. Really, it was. Meantime, we're going to need John to cruise around on the streets of uh, San Francisco. I, I think he's earned the rest of the day off, to be honest. He he's done a lot of work out here. It's been a long day as well. He's done a lot of shit in the day, aside from, you know, almost dying in a car accident. But uh, between this and Life on Mars, seems like some of the best media, some of the best cop shows start with someone in the present day nearly dying in a car accident. So uh, thank you all so much. Thank you for the tips. Thank you for the subscribe the subscriptions. You <laughs> drive on the moon. Oh, I'm sorry. 10 out of 10. <laughs> thank you for thank you for everything today. Honestly, you're all the best. I've been what's this? Speed dare. Stay above 70 mile an hour in a bus. All right, I will. Right, first you've got to give me a bus. An actual bus. Yeah, it's an actual bus. Okay, so right then. Here we go. Bonk. Can this bus even do 70 miles an hour? I don't know, but we're about to find out. And if we don't, uh, it will blow up. I think that's how that film goes anyway. Here we go. All the passengers on this bus are like, Jesus Christ. The bus normally means we're late to work, not early. Yeah, well, not today, motherfuckers. Oh, the Goodwood Hill Climb. I will give you that. That was cool in GT6. Remember that. And it had the first iteration of the... Uh, the Nismo GT Academy. Boom! Sorry, I just I just like doing that to random passes by. <laughs> oh, hello. I know what we can do. I know what we can do. Hello! Smash! <laughs> it was an accident, I swear. Oh, no, it was an accident, I swear. Officer, you got to believe me. Ref! Oh! <laughs> we could just go on a rampage now in a bus. And uh, I, I think, you know, if, if Tanner wants to do that, if that's Tanner's way of... Uh, you know, winding down after a stressful day on the beat and, you know, nearly dying in a car accident, then, you know, we should respect squishes, really, so... <sighs> I'm just waffling on. Oh, man, that's sore. <laughs> I'll, uh... I'll see you guys on Twitch. Let's jump in this car, why not? I'm out of here. Red lights are for losers. I like you already. I also like your car. So, uh, yeah, while we cruise around in Rhino's Nutmobile, I will see you guys... Wednesday evening will be the return of another session on the mile on YouTube. Otherwise, for the next stream, that'll be the set of sessions Thursday, 2 p.m. UK time. And then we'll start Grand Stream 05 with the double header. 6 p.m. UK time, Friday evening. And then Saturday, 2 p.m. the very next day. So have a lovely rest of your Monday. And uh, thank you for all the support. I'll see you guys in a bit.